Hello, hello, welcome to Quackalope, and today we are giving you the much-requested four-player game of Root. At last! Yeah, there's been a lot of people asking for this. Yeah, and not only that, but we're giving some of the requested factions, including the yep. Lizards, the Otters, the Vagabond, even the Vagabond with one of the new expansion cards. Yeah, you'll touch on what we're playing there in yep. a second. Mm -hmm. And the Sailor Duck. Of course. Naturally. Gotta have yeah. He's important too. Yeah. And we're playing on the lakeside, which right. I've been fascinated to see how the otters run on the lakeside for a long time. The disappointing part of this gameplay, right off the bat, is Jan is playing the otters, and so you won't really get a fair demonstration of what they could do. <laughs> yeah, no, You're yeah. gonna have to imagine He's not yourself. wrong. That being said, I'm Jesse Quackalope. Jan, uh, he's Quackalope adjacent, a Honk. goose if we're gonna if we're gonna specify. Uh, we have Mike down here. He has joined us for our Oath gameplay. A little bit more news on that in a second. And Matt down here, the uh, the reigning champion? No, I haven't uh, won Root on camera yet. Oh, is no. that? Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, in my defense, uh -huh. I, in my defense, I was playing the uh, the uh, underground duchy on hard on hard mode. You were. Yeah. So, yeah, you don't actually need to have all of the clearings matching the suits. Just FYI, in case just, people just matching clearings. Yeah. yeah. Not. Matching. Yeah. I, yeah. I didn't break any rules. That's true. I just made it a little harder on myself. You were playing against Jan. I understand wanting to give yourself a challenge. I also didn't take a lot of points. <laughs> You're doing a My very... God, it's like I'm the, I'm the, the thing, right? You're doing yeah. a very the system like, Yeah. yeah. Pum, pum, mm -hmm. pum, 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 all the time. Mm -hmm. You're doing a very similar thing in here, here in this game. You're playing what you think might be one of the more challenging Vagabonds. So... Yeah. We kind of understand how these guys play. The expansions have been out for a while. We'll do the flavor text and then we'll just get into the gameplay so you guys can see how they function. But this is unique. This is something different. Well, it's still the Vagabond. It still has the same True. Vagabond rules. It's just got a few uh -huh. restrictions that are that are new. There is he doesn't no, have boots. There's no movement for this uh, <laughs> Vagabond available. Not right off the bat. There's the slip action. There's the slip action and, and there's the glide action. Yeah. Yeah, oh. so the glide action, I can expend a torch to move anywhere on the yeah. board. Anywhere? Anywhere. So before we get to the flavor text, you guys know I'm a massive fan of flavor mm -hmm. text, so we're gonna lean into that. I, I wanna say two things. First off, this video is coming out before Oath. Yeah. Uh, so a lot what? of you, I know, a episode lot of you three. are probably checking in on Oath episode three. We've got a lot of new subscribers who are fans of Leader Games. I'm sure you're checking in on this video going, where, they had time to film Root, <laughs> where's Oath? Well. Right before this video, we uh, we took the time and we filmed episode three of Oath. And yep. we just want to say thank you for all the support and love that series has been, has been given. We are releasing that in the last 48 hour mark of the Kickstarter campaign. Mark so your calendars. Get excited, keep an eye out. Uh, we will be shouting about it from the rooftops when it goes live. It is, the second one was good. Uh, it was just as it, just as rewarding as the second oh one. Oh my god! I had a I had a really good time. Some uh, of us were more rewarded than others. That's yeah. true. Uh. That's true. So, <laughs> with this root video, the same thing that I always do up front at the beginning of this videos is I tell you guys make sure you unsubscribe, don't follow, don't comment, don't like, don't share it with your friends. Mm -hmm. We want this to yep. stay just for you. Um, mm -hmm. So between so, us. So if anybody comes around, us. just like hide yeah. the screen. Very very private. Uh, that being said, let's get into some flavor text, and then let's get into me winning this game. Oh, I can't I'm wait not gonna to say see anything. how you I've seen. That. I edited it. I've seen the ending. I left this in if I won. So. Oh, so you can see the future now, too. I mean, more or less. Oh, okay. All right, well, Marky. You see the past, not the future. <laughs> Am I starting? Clear? Sure. Ooh, All right, fine. Marquise. The Marquise de Cat occupies the woodland and wants to turn it into an industrial and military powerhouse. Each time the Marquise builds one of her buildings, a workshop, sawmill, or recruiter, she scores victory points. The more of the same building she has on the map, the more points she scores. However, to fuel the ongoing construction, the Marquise must maintain and protect a strong, interconnected economy of wood. I will rip this forest to the ground. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's see what this vagabond's doing. The oh. lonely hero uh, that you know. Our our theory mm -hmm. is that the vagabond is the person who leaves and goes yep. into Oath, mm -hmm. becomes an exile, uh, the explorer, the exile. becomes yeah. the exile, loses here and ventures forth into that new realm. Although, unfortunately, I think someone from Leader. 
Is that is a thing? I, no, no, no. I, I, I don't remember no. it really. They deny too strong. Our theory stands. Read your flavor text. It makes sense. It'll support it. Watch. Listen to this. <laughs> the Vagabond plays all sides of the conflict, making friends and enemies as suits his needs. That's basically a preview to Oath. Right. <laughs> While going on quests to increase his renown through the wood. Renown, like same prestige. thing as prestige. Right. Yep. As the Vagabond improves his relationships with other factions, citizen, or removes pieces of factions hostile towards him, he scores victory points. Victory points, same thing. That's literally same how concept. They're it's even using thing. similar terminology across the board. Yeah. If leader, leader games, I'm calling you out right now. These worlds are interconnected. Board game conspiracies. Easily, easily. We're leaning into this. You cannot deny the truth any longer. Let's go ahead and figure out what this Riverfolk company is doing. We demand your honesty. Yeah. So, Riverfolk Company. When news arrived that the woodland on the shore of the Great Lake was descending into all-out war, the Riverfolk Company quickly dispatched its officers to set up shop. As the other factions purchase services, the Riverfolk will be able to further entrench their commercial interests by building trade posts across the forest. The construction of these posts is a viable way to score victory points, but so too are dividends. They might gain from their wealth. Nice. And uh, and finally, the Lizard Cult. Lizard Cult. <laughs> Pretty excited yeah. to play this. Some would say you hold the dark secret. This is a weird one. Yeah. The cult relies on word of mouth and beak to spread its gospel, and new enclaves can spring up anywhere on the map. Where the cult rules clearings, they can build gardens, which will further radicalize the animals that live there. While other factions spend cards to achieve their aims, the cult acts chiefly by revealing cards and gradually drafting the ideal set of followers. Unless used for scoring, these cards are not spent and are returned to the cult's hand during evening. However, this gentler approach makes movement and battle difficult, so these actions can only be undertaken by the most radicalized members of the cult, their acolytes. Whoa. Now, I just have to say, uh, because I know my audience, I know the people that watch this, they sub for Kingdom Death, for Madara, for, you know, every time I hear that description and connect it with the fact that you are our graveyard, our discard pile of the game, those gardens take on a much darker undertone. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just throwing that out there. Just throwing that out there. Yeah, they're not just full of uh, peonies, you know? They are. <laughs> they are certainly not. Uh, the last thing I want to do before we actually officially get started, I want to go over um, our keywords up at the top. Yep. These standard rules of Root apply, but these are modifications that when you start every session of Root, you really should make sure the table is fully aware of. So start there at the top. Let us know your specific keywords. All right. So I'm nimble. Mm -hmm. That means that I can move regardless of who rules the clearing. Yep. I'm also a lone wanderer, and what that means is that my pawn is not a warrior, and it cannot be removed from the map. Mm. And then you have one other specification, because you're playing the Harrier, you have a glide function. What is that? Yeah, so uh, if I exhaust, and this is basically a, a standard Vanguard mechanic, yep. you exhaust uh, items in your satchel to do things, I can exhaust the torch to glide, and that will allow me to move to any clearing on the map. Yep. Wild. Over here with the Marquise de Cat, uh, the keep, which is up here in the top corner, only you can place pieces in the clearing with the keep token. Important. And then field hospitals. Whenever a Marquise warrior is removed, you may spend a card matching its clearing to move the warrior to a clearing with the keep token. So I can, you know, very quickly rescue some people. Yep. Top of your board here. Yeah, so the Riverfall Company has for sale. This is why I wanted to make sure everyone at the table went through their top actions. Mm -hmm. This is key. For right. sale, I have a public hand, mm -hmm. okay? So anything I draw is gonna be shown right here. And we are also swimmers. You treat rivers or lakes as paths and may move along rivers or lakes regardless of ruler. This is really unique for this board specifically. Mm -hmm. The ferry here, will allow us, whoever is playing that aren't the otters, to move from these four corners. However, if we would like, 
and we don't have the ferry, but we need to move, we can actually purchase your ability, your yep. swimmer ability, to bring us across the river. Mm -hmm. um, so this is a unique application here on the map because so much of it is dominated by that central lake area. Yeah, and the riverboat specifically isn't as accessible as it might seem because it's only wherever the pond is, right? Yeah. So, so this is this is the ferry. You mm -hmm. control the riverboats. Yep. You can see some little graphics of them down here, kind of on the board. Uh, and then over here, what's the top board of your lizard cult say? Well, they like revenge. Um, your removed defending warriors become acolytes. So when I lose in battle, it actually gives me ammo to mm. then continue my yep. nefarious schemes. Uh, we hate birds. Bird cards are not wild from our rituals. Yep. And finally, we are uh, pilgrims. We rule any clearings where we have any gardens. Oh, wow. Okay. That's right. So, yeah. So those gardens trump all other rules. Just across the board. Rules, yeah. Yep. Wow. Uh, I believe at the top of the round, the marquee starts, or is that just with setup? That's just with setup. We can start with whoever we want. All right. Well, go ahead, Vagabond. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, um, I've only played the Vagabond once, so forgive Excuse me I'm if I... I'm uh, excuses, Jim. You know, what I'm worried wow. about... sounds familiar. What I, yeah. what I <laughs> want to avoid is cheating by not... Um, discarding a card at a certain time or anything oh, no, the, like that. The odds are you'll cheat. 100%. <laughs> Isn't that your ammo? Alright, so I'm gonna slip into this clearing. Okay. Well, here we go. Starting off... And then I am going to aid the oh. otters. Oh, that's very kind. Oh. I'm yeah. aid the otters. You're scoring a victory and point. And I'm gonna score a victory point by aiding the otters. Uh -huh. You realize I was there as well. Oh. Uh, oh, if I, yeah, I wish I had another card that I could oh. aid you. You know, here's the mm -hmm. thing. Jan is not very good at this game, and he needs a little bit of a uh -huh. a little bit of an advantage. So. Okay, I'm pretty sure I've won one or two times. I don't remember. That. Out of the five times we played, I'm pretty sure I've won at least two of them or once. But maybe, yeah, yeah maybe, well, maybe, maybe. All right, all right. I'll, I'll get you when I come around cool. next time. Sounds good. Um, and so then I'm also going to exhaust this torch to take a look in the ruin. Mm -hmm. Ooh, a hammer. That's not bad. So I get to take this hammer. Oh, and this ruin's actually cleared, right? The, That's a The ruin is zone. cleared, yeah. Nice. Uh, and then I could attack. That would be unnecessary. I could attack. Um, I'm trying to think if I can do anything else. If you this attack, time. you immediately go to hostile, though. If I attack, I immediately go to hostile. That is correct. Yeah. Um, I don't know if I need to do that just yet. Um, fortunately, I don't have much else I can do. Oh, wait. Uh, oh, it's too late for me to take advantage of the clearings of the, uh, of the otters, because I have to do that at the start of my bird song. So I am going to just go ahead and end, uh, go into evening. Uh, I don't have anything to repair, but I get to draw one card plus one for every, uh, coin. Okay. And because I start with an extra coin, I get to draw two cards right mm -hmm. off the, do the nice. top. Nice. Discard down to five, but I've got uh, only four, so I am done. Okay. Uh, I get to place one wood at each sawmill. So also, just just as a quick reminder, you can also purchase at the very at the very at the very top of my round, mm -hmm. and I'm paying people for it, right? Mm -hmm. And you have a current cost of one per. Yeah, for everything. That's not a bad price. I know. What it's do we ha price. What do we have over here? So we have a bird. Mm -hmm. We have mouse partisans, we have swamp meat, and we have tunnels. Tunnels, you treat clearings with any of your crafting pieces at, as adjacent. As adjacent? Okay. Mm -hmm. um, mouse partisans, in battle, in mouse clearings, you may deal one extra hit, then discard all of your cards except one. And mm -hmm. swap meat, that's where you're trading cards in people's hands. Okay, so I'm going to start by generating wood. So this is something that I would like for, uh, for, for me to know earlier on. Uh, the people that you guys are using to pay me with are the ones in your reserves, correct? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're paying you with our... And what I do is I will exhaust my items... In order yep. to pay. And you will put your own warriors in the yep. payments. Yep, Now, what are cards really used for? Just crafting? Is that mainly what cards are used for for me? Uh, you can use them to craft, and um, that's a good one. That's the main functionality. Um, I'm not buying anything from you at the moment. You're not? 
Uh, I, you have you have nothing in your market that really interests me that much. What? I, There's such good I'm things I'm really here. sorry, but... Uh, moving down to craft. That's the first. Using workshops. I currently only have one workshop, and it's in a bunny zone. Um, I can craft the Woodland Runners. You can, indeed. Uh, that is very attractive to you. That's nice to... Yeah, I like so, that So, uh, if I craft this, mm -hmm. you know, I, I would like to think that we're being friendly. It would be very friendly. We'd be very friendly together, That'd be nice, right? yeah. Because you thought about attacking me there for a second. I didn't think for a second. You considered about... it. You certainly considered it. Well, I have to consider it. That's fair, but I'm not holding it against you. Okay. I'm just checking where we stand. Well, we stand in a good... It, it, we're indifferent right would now, we, but we, we, could, we could get a little bit would further. Would we stand better if you had boots? We would. Okay. We would. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and craft those. Uh, that will score me one victory point. Mm -hmm. Does that go to uh, my Lost Souls it pile? It does. does go to the Lost Souls. It does go to your Lost Souls pile. Okay, so I just crafted. That does go to your Lost Souls pile. Um, second action, take up to three plus one per bird card you spend. That's what bird cards could be used for. Can I, in retrospect, purchase a card? Because I, I asked what cards are used for. I don't care if the rest of the team okay. doesn't okay. care. I, I am, because I was looking at the bird card wondering if I could utilize that bird card action. Uh, I am going to go ahead and purchase this bird card just so I have it in my hand. Because I thought it might be useful, but I didn't know what it could be useful for. Battle, march, recruit, build, and overwork. Battle, pretty classic. March, take two moves and I can bring people with me. Which is a uh, an interesting element. So, I'm going to start with a march action. I'm gonna move one and then two. So I'm moving up to that corner. I'm then going to do a build action. In a clearing you rule, place a build building, spending its cost in wood connected through any numbers of clearings you rule. I don't clearly, I don't currently rule there. The otters do. But I do rule down here. I will go ahead and build down here in this corner. I'm gonna build a workshop. That's gonna gain me two victory points for that building. Um, and I believe I'm gonna do one more move action. Doesn't that cost you wood? Uh, it did, it did cost me wood here yeah. to go ahead and build that. Thank you for catching that. And then a, a last move action, I'm gonna move one and two back here to this location. Um, I could spend a card to place one wood at a sawmill. That's it. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna pay that bird card that I just bought. I am going to move down to evening. Draw one card plus one card per showing. I don't have any showing. They're gonna be underneath some of these. So one card comes back to my hand, and uh, jam. Can I just go ahead and say one thing real quick? I, I realized that when I aid, I am supposed to exhaust an item. Okay. I knew that there was one thing that I was not remembering. And so I went ahead and exhausted this sword just because I aided you. So, okay, fair enough. Cool. Fair enough. First things first, protectionism. Mm -hmm. Payments box is empty, place two warriors in it. I, I died that is not empty, so we can move forward. Score dividends if any trade posts are on the map, none are on the map, and finally, gather funds. Move all warriors on faction board to the funds box. So I take everything in my payment section, and now they are available for me to use. I forgot about dividends. This is something I never score with, but it could potentially be very powerful if you've got enough of the things out there. So essentially you have to yeah. not do certain actions, right? You have to accumulate. Yeah. You're holding yourself back in a different way. You're holding yeah. yourself back, but it can potentially get you a lot of points. Yeah. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna commit some funds to establish a trade post with a garrison. Um, and we're gonna go ahead and establish that trading post right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and I commit one of my res my reserve, correct? Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Yep. And But you have to, sp when you do a garrison, aren't you spending, it's not a commitment, right? Establishing a trade post, you're spending, spending two a fund. funds. So yes. you're spending a fund, you're not, you're not committing, committing them. them. So you're gonna take those out of your there you go. And if you spent oh, mine, it would come so back. So it's different. To me. They're completely out. It's when you there's it, there's a key difference in the in the terminology. There's commitments yeah. and there's spending. When you spend, you take it out of commitments and you move it back to the general supply. When you craft, you're committing, which keeps them in the cycle. Yep. Oh um, wow. Yep. That's why if you're if you're going to build a trade post in a clearing ruled by another player, you have mm. to spend. 
funds that are their warriors. Mm -hmm. And you scored two victory points for that trade post. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then I'm going to go ahead and dedicate for crafting. Mm -hmm. Oh, so that's a commitment, so that would go there. Right. In order to create create swap meet. Oh, and I also gained two victory points. You got them? Cool. Uh, and swap meet. Once in Birdsong, may take a random card from another player and then give them a card. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just cycle. It does, it's not bad for him to cycle his deck. That's actually no. kind of a nice yeah. one to have. So why did you get two victory points, though? Because he, he built that trade post. Oh, you get two victory points when you yep. do the trade post? Yep. That's nice. Okay, and <laughs> I, I don't think I can do much else. Yeah, because I'm definitely not letting go of this guy for now. That's cool. I gave him to I you. I need him. Yeah. Okay, and, that, and that'll and that be it, really. Um, so this card down to five cards, I have none. Mm -hmm. How do I actually, how do I gain more cards? Uh, some of your some of your things will help you draw up. Draw, commit a fund to draw a card. Got it. Okay, and then cert, set services costs. So, so you, you, could, could, you could you commit could commit that guy. this guy. I'm not. No, no, he won't go away. Oh, he doesn't go committing away? Him committing him spending. Committing is just oh, moving down. Oh, I found down that there. if I committed them, I would lose them. No, no. that's only for oh. spend. spending. Spending. Yeah. Okay, that's really good. Um, I don't really care about that right now, so let's definitely take... Let's go ahead and commit him so I can draw another card. Right, yep. Okay, let's Replenish see if we... that marketplace. Ooh, so we are moving <laughs> hand card to two. <laughs> Ambush card. We're moving that to two. You sure you want to go to two? Yeah, yeah, I, two I mean, is you fine. You might be able to squeeze three out of people. This is the beginning of the game. Nah, Ambush is valuable. No, I, I'm. I think I'm good with two. Uh, two is enough. I mean, I tried to tell him what the market price might be, mm -hmm. but that's all right. Are you saying you would pay me three? No, I, I don't know. So uh, it's now it's moving on. All right, you're taking advantage of a new player. He's trying to speed this up. You notice that before you had a chance to resolve your. Uh, he wants to. He wants to cycle it a little bit. Uh huh. Okay, Go ahead. onto so the lizard. I need to adjust my outcast, though. I have a bird, though. So what does that do to my outcast? So the, the outcast does not change. Mm -hmm. okay. That means whatever it's now set at becomes the hated outcast. Yeah. Okay. So mice are hated. Great. Now the birds will go into our discard pile. Yep, so they'll come over so here. So they'll go into the real discard pile. Let's set them up here. Okay, cool. And um, so now it uh, now perform conspiracies. Can't do that. I don't have any acolytes this time. Mm -hmm. Um, now move on to daylight. Right. I can mm -hmm. build, recruit, score, or I can sacrifice some things too. I want to build. Okay. Ooh. So I'm gonna put this fox card down. That will allow me to build a garden yep. in this one over here. Okay. Because I, you rule there. Yeah. Because yep. he has control. And he rules on on a bunny also, right? Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. yep. Okay. I'm going to play this card. So I'm going to recruit on a bunny. Okay. Put him here. Okay. And mm -hmm. I will immediately kill him. <laughs> I will sacrifice him to the lizard gods. Uh -huh. Oh, well done. Yeah. He'll become yeah. an acolyte. That's smart. That was That's pretty good, good right? Yeah. Wow. Okay. 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 Now, gonna... when you re when you sacrifice, does that card? You're spending the card, right? So that goes. No, to it's the only hospital? it's only spending if I um if I score. Yeah, it only says this card on that one. Oh, so sacrifice stays in your hand. Okay. Move one of your warriors from the map to the Alkalites box. Mm -hmm. It doesn't say anything else. Okay. Yeah, he's, just re he's just revealing cards. Wow, so does he have like the perfect hand to just like... I guess so. I could have sworn that with birds you had to discard though. Okay. It doesn't, yeah, it doesn't say. It just says move. Only this one says this card. Okay. Uh, I'm not going to craft anything. And now I'm going to draw one card, and I'm not going to discard anything. Mm -hmm. Here's a draw for you. Thank you, sir. No now, discards? One thing I remember from playing the lizards before is sure. you, you actually get to cycle through a lot of cards. Mm -hmm. So the lizards are a great faction to be crafting things with. Yeah, that's true. And crafting could be a core part of your victory points mm -hmm. as well. Um, so don't ignore it, maybe? Right. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, coming over to the Vagabond, who now oh, has the me. opportunity to get a boot, which is the one thing right. you were missing. So, I get to... I probably shouldn't have made that. Um, do that. And, yeah, I guess I have to... But to, to get aid, I have to give you a card of a matching clearing. Which is a little more problematic. Hey, right here. I'm... Here's a bunny. I'm literally in every clearing, and you could potentially buy something from the Otters. It's right here. I you are mean, not literally in every clearing. <laughs> I'm in fox, mouse, and uh... No, but oh. I think he needs to give you from the clearing he's in. Oh, well, he but can... I like this card I've got. Right here, it's a really, got, it's not I even like a good card. I like this card I've got. 
Son of a gun. All right. Oh, I really like this card. I don't want to give it up, but I'm going to do it. Okay. Uh, I'm going to aid. Okay. I mean, I don't, I don't know if you're supposed to show it to the table. But... Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> well, I'm going to show that it's a bird card. Yeah. I didn't see it. Uh, and that's going to move us up here, and I take the boot. Mm. Good doing business with you, Sam. Thank you. Very mm. good doing business with you. So nobody wants a ton of Um... <laughs> <laughs> okay, just making you're sure. Still, you're still petting your squirrels. Hey, so no one, you're telling me no one wants a tunnel? You don't I mean, want a tunnel? You don't want a tunnel? tunnel? Uh, so well, I'll just I fill in this hole then. from here I will go ahead and... Um, it seems a little I'm too gonna, like, I'm going to go ahead right and... Now. Everyone's uh, like, talking like really good friends. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if I like it or not. I don't know if I like it or not. You you like killing oh, things. Oh, it's so you're hard horrible. to decide. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to actually, I'm going to... Oh, I'm in, the, I'm in a bunny clearing. I'm going to fend off a bear. Oh, that's nice. So you got is that a quest? quest? Yeah, it's a quest. I'm gonna up fend there. off a bear. Oh. Nice. Fend off the how bear. How many points does that get you? That's uh, well, you know what? I think. And how I... many points does Aiden oh, doesn't so get you? Oh, he does. It gets you one. I'm gonna just take two cards for that. <laughs> oh, okay. So, 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 can somebody clarify this for me? So, in the world of Root, there are animals that are not sentient. Like they, they don't have thoughts. Like there's animals and then there's I, I animal say, folk. I would say the bears have thoughts. They're not playable characters, but they're certainly. I mean, but are they are they like are they like people in this world, or are they just animals? No, I I think if I'm playing based off of my historic knowledge of Redwall, mm. there are uh, bad and good mm -hmm. creatures. Like there's there's things that exist, and so a bear. Uh, while you could have a bad or a good bear, the bear that he fended off, while it does have sentient thought, it's probably like a lone wanderer. It's it's more like coming in and ravaging the camp and then leaving. It's someone that you'd want to defend the villagers against. Mm -hmm. but, but oh, I completely of... forgot about spending mm. cards with the uh, otters. Mm. Yeah, I told you multiple times that you could purchase cards from me. You did mention it quite I a I pointed and directly. It... Did you? Yes, at the card. He's, tunnel that you could have given Jesse instead of, an, of a bird well, card. You should have been doing it when I was paying attention. That's right? true. That's true. You gotta be a bit better salesman. What the heck? Yeah. Okay. Just be like... Yeah. Until I look at you... You can count on it. You have to look... I have to look at you in the eyes uh -huh. and then I'll... You should remember. actually... Sales you can tactics. Count on it. Yeah, sales tactics. You should, you should do your very best to make sure that an item ends up in someone's hand. Mm -hmm. When they're trying to sell it to you, you're not going to get that, that way. Time. That way, by the time they have it in their hand, they really, really hate the idea of giving it back. All right, that's I'm going to go ahead. That's a good that's proposition. A good tactic. So yeah, like, I like it. If I just get this, can you get that out of my face? <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and craft a charm offensive. Mm -hmm. uh, at the start of evening, you may draw a card and choose another player to score one point. Mm. Um, and then, I suppose I should move. And you know, I would you, really you like. You I, I really wish I could move out into the lake because I would like. I would have preferred to go out there. I would have can given. You, can you not buy riverboats now? Well, I mean, I thought that the ruling was I could not. That's why I went ahead and just built this. Otherwise, if if the ruling was that I could, of course you can. Then I would have well, not. Well, it depends on when can you. At the yeah, start supposed to be at the their, start of bird song. Bird song. You can't buy them now. Yeah, you, but I mean, you. He would have. We let you do it. He would have. Go ahead. All right. <laughs> so, we let you do it. So I am two. going to flip two. So you're going to get to do that. And then I'm going to exhaust my boot mm -hmm. to just cruise on over here. And technically, you can keep on doing that as many times as you want. This well, I have to have round. boots to do it. Mm -hmm. I have to have boots to move. Interesting. Okay. And then I think now that gets me to the end of what I can possibly do. Going into evening... Uh, I get to draw a card, mm -hmm. plus a card for every coin I have, uh, and now I have to draw this card down to five. While I discard down to five, I go ahead and say my turn is over, and uh, you guys can go ahead and figure out what you're doing. Okay. Top of the round, place one wood at each sawmill. I have one sawmill. I will place mm -hmm. one wood down. Let's see here. What... Can I do? So first, I just want to remind you ah. that there are certain wares. What do you have for sale here? That's 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 a great card at a really good price. That's a good Dude, price. It's an excellent I card. I think it works better when you put it close to his face. It's also, like price. this one is great. You I, can take both. I cannot believe both of them. Here's the funny thing. I just taught you to get a card in someone's hand to and convince it, them to keep it. You got that so smoothly into my hand, and I I swear I was sitting here going. 
Oh, I'd hate to give this card. back. Yep, thank you. I'd hate to set this back down on the table. Uh, it's a great card to have at an excellent price. That is a really, that's I a could, really I, good I, I would price. tell you, this could it's save you. This could save you. You'd pretty I just close. aided you with one of those, though. Yeah, down that's the a, road, that is a so fantastic card. You are absolutely right. And thank two you. is a deal. I would have paid three for that card. It's a good I know, one. but yeah. I, hey, I want to establish a good and now you've good got terms two with you. Now you've got two of those. Do, yeah. Do, that is a thing that I have. Me, you know, exactly. Home. All right, moving down to craft. Craft using your workshops. I currently have two workshops out on the board, which will allow me to craft a bake sale. Ooh, that bake looks sale yummy. is going to get me... Gonna keep you wanting to do business with me, sir. Yeah. Didn't you just buy that from my market? I did not. Hmm. That was in my hands. Wait, so before. you're buying from other sellers? No, I I started with that. My grandparents taught me how to do oh. a bake sale back when I was a wee lad. Okay, because you gotta support your local, your local store. Oh, I'm supporting my local store. Don't you okay. worry. I've got cool. three of my people on your board. That's true. Take up to three actions plus one per bird card you spend. They're doing a great job. Okay. Mm -hmm. I can battle, march, recruit, build, and overwork. I'm gonna start, I believe, with a... Hmm. This is complicated. <laughs> I'm going to start with a march action. I'm going to march from here to... No, I'm gonna do it the opposite way think. No, I've got to go up and connect. I'm marching from here to here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go ahead and do a second march action. I'm going to move. I really want to cross this river and it's in the way so much. So why, why didn't you pay me? <sighs> do you want to pay me? No. Matt did it. It's so, it's so in the way. Hey, 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 hey. You can do this. You, we can just assume uh -huh. that you had paid me for the riverboat. Uh, no, it's too late. I don't. I'm going to, I'm going to spend one action. I've done a move action. I'm going to spend a recruit action, which is only going to get me one guy, right here in this location. Um, I'm go and I'm going to do a build action, which is going to allow me to set something down. Question is, where do I have some space? Some space here. What and what do I want to? Oh, you only have one wood. <sighs> I know. So I'm spending this wood to go ahead and build. I'm yep. gonna build a sawmill. Smart. We're gonna set that sawmill up here in this top corner. Nice. I'm gonna move these guys so I remember it's there. I'm not gonna discard. Instead, I'm gonna spend a card to go ahead and do another action. So this will be added to the discard pile. Okay. Um, and the secondary action that I would like to do is I'm gonna go ahead and overwork my mills. So we're spawning a wood there and we're spawning a wood nice. up top there. I think that's gonna be it. I'm drawing up a single card. I'm discarding down to five. I currently have five in my hand and it is on to you, Jan. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is a swap meet. So I always say that the best thing to sell to my clients is the things they already have. Mm -hmm. So- I knew you were gonna do this. <laughs> I knew he was gonna do this. <laughs> that's why I left five cards in my hand. I couldn't get lower than that. Oh, you used to give me, you were getting me all the time with that swap me when I was the moles. That's terrible. And this is for you? Thank you. Oh, look at that. It's a nice little mouse. That's excellent. Oh, I hate that he has that built. It's a cool card for this faction to have built, though. Mm. So, I gain all of these funds. Unfortunately, I'm not going to score any dividends this time, mm -hmm. right? Um, my, I did not get to activate protectionism either because we had some funds there. So let's go ahead and move into daylight. So first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna craft. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and commit this little guy right here so we can make travel gear. So please move me one up and I will take those final <laughs> boots. So hey, Vagabond. You got some boots coming. I do have some boots and oh, they have your name on it. Boots are made for walking. And that's just what you're gonna do. Yeah, so, so I'm gonna commit to in order to draw two cards, please. I think I can reach them actually. Let's see what I get. Oh, a domination card. That's not gonna help me at all. Ooh, and a I mean, unless someone really wants to own all three rabbit clearings. I guess. Hmm, I wonder who might that be? Mm. Oh. I'm not going for all three rabbit clearings, don't you worry, buddy. <laughs> Those domination well, cards like, are hey, you death know, blow. 
they're like a Hail Mary if you're at the end of your I know. rope. They're so fun to try, but... Yeah. That's tough. So, you know what? You've been such a loyal customer. Mm, I have been. That we're gonna go ahead and spend these guys. Awesome. To establish a trading post. Right here. Oh, I love having a trading post there. Yeah. Remind, what do trading posts do? Um, so that actually gives you access to more cards that you yep. can buy on my turn. You, you can take advantage of more items. So you can mm -hmm. like so buy- So right now I'm only able to do one, but a trading post will allow me to do multiple. Right, yep. so you could buy a card, you could buy two cards. Mm -hmm. You could buy a card and you the, use the riverboats. Okay. So I'm gonna do that. And then I'm going to commit my guy right here in order to build the gently used knapsack. So, hey, Vagabond, I got some good stuff for you. Yeah, you do. Just spoiler alert, when they say gently used, it, it's it's been thoroughly used. It's but been it's been fairly low. It works. Discard pile over there. Yep, right. over here, and everybody. Um, oh, I built this just this turn. Yep. That's over there too, right? Yeah, and that's pretty much it for me. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and set some pricing, so you can do that in the meantime. Okay. Well, you can do your turn. I mean. So mm -hmm. I've got a lot of cards here this turn. It looks like the bunnies mm -hmm. will be the outcast. So not hated mice anymore. Okay. Bunnies are now the outcast. He's I only, mean, you still don't really like the mice. I though. mean, I really don't like anyone who's not a lizard at this point. That's true. So these are going to go over to this card. Um, mm. I do have acolytes now, but I don't have enough to do anything mm. now that I don't have yeah. the hated. The bunnies aren't anymore. hated. Mm -hmm. So we're going to just shoot along right here to daylight. Hmm? Let's see what we can do here. So, so wait, 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 wait. Is there anything that you couldn't take advantage of here? <laughs> like, for example... The mouse it's partisans it's look card. Look at my face. I might. Let, let me let me read the mouse partisans cards to you. In battle, in mouse clearings, <laughs> you may deal one extra yes. hit. Then this card, all your cards except mice. Yeah, I kind of do need a mouse card. Oh, dude. So and I'm not not to like help him sell his wares. Mm -hmm. That discard mechanic on that lets you determine what your next cycle might be. And I also have a like, super that cheap could for actually you. Be a pretty. I just cool have it at one. one. What are, you, what are you gonna lose with just one? Because you could discard your entire hand and guarantee a a cycle. And you can do that oh, strategically. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. So if you had a hand of like three or four bunnies, you could almost guarantee bunnies are gonna become hated on the next round. Take some forethought. That's not a bad card for you. So I can discard. I can discard down past five or. Well, this. If you use this, it would oh, let you discard yeah. everything but one, except mice. Mm-hmm. So. Just and I have it really cheap for you too. And just so a when I buy something from him, mm -hmm. I spend an army, right? Or... You give me one of your little yeah. guys, and they're gonna go in my payments box. Okay. Yeah. But I'm gonna put them to work. Like they're gonna do yeah. great. They're so they're gonna really be like hurt selling me, stuff. Just helps him. Yeah. yeah. And what's your prices now for the cards? Just one. Just one. Yeah. Super cheap. Oh, yeah. I think I really do want a mouse card. It's a it's a great investment. And you need to craft this, and then that ability is useful at any point beyond this turn. Yeah. So I have to craft it. You yes. would. You'd need to be able to craft at a bunny zone. Okay, but and, you, and your guy's just gonna be selling perfume at my at my locations. Okay. He's just gonna be trying stuff out, helping people out. Mm -hmm. They're gonna they're gonna have be very happy. Even though we're like really weird lizard people, I think I still need to avail myself to the greater community. Yeah, of course. To, to further my ends, support your local store. Well, and let's be honest, the lizard people, y'all need a bit of perfume. Yeah, we kind of do have our fingers and everything anyway. You they, know, they need a bit of perfume. So yeah. here you go. Well, thank you. Thank you you may take your though. card. Thank you so very much. All right, so. And so now I have a dominance card that I don't know if anybody <laughs> no wants to buy. No one's going to buy that, buddy. <laughs> That's the only thing I want to do here. Who might buy it for this, dude? You never know. How do you How do you win dominance, Vagabond? I don't. I um, I can share uh, a victory. So I you can could, form a coalition. I can form a coalition. Ooh. Can you still keep working at your victory point track? No, a coalition my ties victory, him yeah. to the last person. So if like, if if we were above 10, I believe, or no, I think it's 15, right? 10. If we were above 10 and uh, and he wanted to tie himself to the losing player. Well, it's I have to be above 10. So you can't ah. play a dominance card until you get to 10 victory points. Yep. Doesn't matter who it is. So it's me, you guys, whatever. If I get 10 victory points, I can play the dominance card. That then binds me to whoever who has the lowest Least. number of victory points his win point. is to help them win. Because his goal, ultimately, is just to become a hero of one yep. of our factions. Yep. So, well, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. So I'm going to build, first of all, mm -hmm. in a bunny zone. Oh, it's a swap meet. 
Those cards are disgusting. <laughs> I oh fully... no no he he revealed it he didn't yeah, I'm craft just it. Not playing it. Uh, he may craft it. it actually afterwards. I I just want to say as a standard, I uh, fully fully disown the partisan deck due to cards such as the swap meet. Oh, I hate the swap meet. That <laughs> thing was driving me nuts. I couldn't get anything going when I was the moles. Granted, I was playing on whole hard mode, but still. Oh, and it's so cool that the River Riverfolk have that because it makes sense for their faction to yeah, have it. Yeah, this is like perfect for me. Yeah, it really is. And I'm gonna play uh, more of these, a uh, fox and a mouse, oh and I'm going to recruit uh -huh. in a fox and a mouse. Of course here. you are. Are you also killing them? I <laughs> then maybe. Yeah. <laughs> so I have a question. If I had two swap meets, would that mean that I could have done that two times? Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. And I'm going to sacrifice two. <laughs> These guys. He's got a little oh, engine no. going here. You should maybe think about swap meeting with this guy that's got a whole system running. Oh, now that I see there's a swap meet in the and, swap meet. Oh, no. Oh, shit. <laughs> now I'm going to pull these back into my hand. <laughs> Jim just discovered something. I don't have any equipment to craft. Oh, right. <laughs> so... <laughs> I don't know if you can have duplicates. Actually, I think that you, that's a rule. I think you cannot have duplicates of something you've crafted. Oh, come on. Sorry, buddy. Really? So this is the end of my turn. Pretty sure. I'm going to draw a card. Someone can... You want to check that? And I want to check I'll that. I'll keep this cut in, because this is a rule that I'm not familiar with. So <laughs> let's, uh, let's keep going your turn. <laughs> Shoot me a card. It's the end of my turn. I would be happy to give you here. a card. Would you like Sorry. this card? Yeah, Usually I, would, I would love that. This one on yeah, top, yeah. the first one. I'm feeling really good about Just that. What about one? the bottom one? No duplicates. I'm feeling one. super good about that. Card. I can't. No duplicates. It's because you touched it. Yeah. So no duplicates. You cannot craft persistent effect if you have an identical persistent effect in okay. your play area. Darn. Sorry. Okay. Br brilliant idea, but it won't work. Darn it. And, I'm, and I, I still have my own. I will lost soul my own discords. Correct. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Wow, I didn't expect a bird to go down. Because he wants the bunnies to be hated next turn. But so why that he can he... take advantage of his conspiracies. Is that, did you not have any bunnies in your hand? Is that, that it? Well, I mean, I think I'm, I'm kind of going for a um, a certain sure. build here, you know? On to the Vagabond. So hey, Vagabond, hey, Vagabond, hey, Vagabond. I got some shoes, I got some shoes, I got some hey, sacks, hey, some hey, sacks, I got you know, a lot of things. You know what's more valuable than the shoes and the sacks? Cold, hard, cold. So here, I'm just going to put this right here. You on guys your... are get about to out of there. really, like, turn... We're about to really get into some stuff. Here. I just offered it once. Um, yeah, sure. So, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I'll, uh, go ahead. I'm, I'm in a mouse clearing, so I'll give you aid. Thank you. To take a boot. Oh, look at that. It's an ambush card. And then guess what? I'll give you another aid. No, so I don't move up. So are you moving um, the you don't move otters up? up? You do, right? Oh, sorry. Move I him move, up. I move the otters wrong. But I have to, I have to aid him twice. Ah. So now I've aided him twice. And now you move up. And now I move up Sorry two about victory that. points. I always forget that that's right. one, two, so three. So you have to aid two times in order to this move is, up. This is now, important too because it's an oversight. I think of it as first, second, third. Yeah, me it's too. It's actually one aid, right. two so, aids, three what, aids. Okay, so hold on. I let, let me. Okay, so, so these things clear, came in. Pay for my things. So mm -hmm. I, okay, so mm -hmm. I'm just kind of remembering what I was doing. So I, I, I didn't mean to do that one. I wanted to... So I'm gonna go ahead and do these two. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and flip those two. And then uh, this goes over here. Mm -hmm. So question, before you keep going, would you like to purchase the very cards you sold me? <laughs> uh, I can't purchase the cards I sold you. It's, it's technically too supposed late. to be at the beginning of Birdsong. It's too oh, late. that's not even Birdsong anymore? Like no. you're not a, okay, so aiding is outside of Birdsong. Okay. Right, right, right. Just letting you know, they're right there. I mean, if you had, if your riverboats were a little one. cheaper, I would Pretty have good. done it. Actually, I probably wouldn't have, but say la vie. Um, and so I am going to go ahead and craft root T. Mm. Oh no, we're spending a oh, few things. That doesn't in there. go there. Goes that goes here. here. All right. Mm. Uh oh. Um. Uh oh, Mike. Not too worried about it yet. <laughs> <laughs> and then. Uh, yeah, then I'm going to go ahead and now. By the way, so after so it you have to craft you have to aid two times to get up to here to mm -hmm. get the two victory points, right? Mm -hmm. And then you have to aid three times mm -hmm. to get up to allied. 
Now, from then on, every single time you aid, it's two, it's two yep. victory points. Unless they attack you, because then you immediately go to enemies. No. Only if I... Only if I remove their their warriors. But if they attack, they could prompt you to remove their warriors. Yeah, yeah, but if yeah, they yeah. roll a zero and I don't take anything off, then we're still cool. <laughs> you, you see what I'm saying? They could, I see, they yeah. Could, yeah. They could force your hand. Of course, yeah. of course. Mm. So I am then going to go ahead and... I still have gold. You jerk. Yeah, but I have to, get to, I have to somehow get to you? Don't make excuses for what you've done. I built that for you. Hey, you made All a right, great tell you decision. What, tell you what, I will exhaust my last boot. Okay. To come to where you are. Wonderful. So that perhaps in on the our future. next turn. Oh, on the next turn? I, I I have to exhaust something to do it, so I can't do it now. It'll, All right. You know, you'll have to I was it. really actually hoping that you'd trade with me. <laughs> I have to be. I, I thought the gold would be really attractive. It is very attractive. <laughs> don't don't get me wrong, but so hey, you know what you could do mm -hmm. to incentivize him to trade with you next time? <laughs> you could craft a sword right don't, now. I, I decided I don't like Janice the salesman. And are you done with <laughs> you your turn? You could also. I'm done with my turn. Okay. Ambush. Yeah. I bet so I... for the price of one card, technically Pump. you get two cards. I can't craft the sword because I don't have fox clearings. But you will have I fox appreciate... clearings. You have one fox clearing right here. I appreciate. And you have one fox clearing oh. right here. You I... could craft both of these. I appreciate the consideration. Um, well, what about a good ambush? I think at the moment those are not as beneficial as you would assume. Before you keep going, how about <laughs> some excellent transportation across these beautiful waters? <laughs> Before you keep going, I love him as the, as the salesman. Yeah. You need more of this to uh, like you come out like this. Oh, I will. I will. Take you that will ambush. take that ambush. Take Thank that you. Ambush. And how about some transportation across the river? I'm okay right now. No, I'm okay. Mm. And a server cruise. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. We have we have music mm -hmm. and everything. Mm -hmm. Also refreshments. Food is extra. Wow. Okay. Uh, place one wood on each sawmill. I currently have two sawmills. Do so you have a total of four wood? I have a total mm. of four wood. That's Take dangerous. up to three actions. One per bird I spend. Okay. Sounds Battle like... march, recruit, build, overwork. I'm going to... Hmm. Oh, I wish craft came after all of these things. Although, no, I've got it. All right, I'm going to go ahead and craft the one card I'm able to, which is tunnels, which you gave me. Um, so that will slide in here. So can you explain to me what that does so exactly? So basically, uh, you treat clearings with any of your crafting pieces as adjacent. So my crafting pieces are specifically these, this, and this. So I now treat this clearing and that clearing as adjacent clearings. Does that make sense? Also, this is also an adjacent clearing. No, that is not a crafting piece. Okay. My crafting pieces, the things I have to have to craft, mm -hmm. are my workshops. Oh, so okay. this workshop and this workshop are currently adjacent. And what what is the benefit of that? I, I just move across the board a little bit easier. Oh, okay. So it's like yeah. it's a transport. Yes. You got it. Tunnels be okay. I got it now. Um cool. So my actions take up to three. I'm gonna start with a build. I'm going to build over here in a fox clearing. Um, that scores me two victory points. I am going to uh, build a second time. Oh, and I got to spend the wood. It was two wood to do that building, so I'm spending that. I'm spending one wood to do my second building, which is going to be a recruitment office. And I think I'm going to place that. Mm -hmm. And right there's also here. another space under me, by the way. I see that. Yeah. Um, Oh, I am going to go ahead and do another build. Yeah, that's what I thought. I believe, actually, I don't have enough wood to do another build. You have one wood. I do have one wood. Mm -hmm. uh, did I get my victory point for that, that yes. last build? Yes, you've been I got moving it, up. I got it for the two. I don't think I got it for the one. You didn't move me up, right? No, I haven't okay. moved you up. Then I didn't get it for this one yet. Mm -hmm. Um... I could overwork, I could recruit. I'm gonna go ahead and do a recruit option. So that'll place two guys down here. Mm. And then I'm going to do, oh, I couldn't, I couldn't have built this mm -hmm. until 
until I had rules. So I actually had to do recruit before. And then do that, which is fine. It doesn't which change anything, given right? Me, no, it does a little bit. Okay. So this actually needs to be in this location. Okay. And recruit would have been at these two because okay. mm -hmm. I would have, recruit first would have been one less recruitment office. Okay. okay. Sounds legit. Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and push it. Um, Congratulations, push it Mike. Handing that over. <gasps> you gave in the ambush? You keep wow. going. I, I keep drawing for it. But I can't. You keep coming after it. I can't use these. These are just determined no yeah. casts. But, he, no, but no, I, no. I have to use a bird to. Yeah. Well, that's great because now you can make a, a rabbit hated. So what I'm going right. to use that for? No, it's the no, I'm going to use it to go ahead and generate some no, wood. No, no, this is the majority. These don't count. So oh, they're in there. Oh, they're not wild oh, for me. Interesting. And yeah. Uh, yeah, the birds aren't wild for me. That's oh. going to be the end of my turn. I'm going to draw up one card. I should have five left in my hand. I do, in fact, have five left in my hand. Good sir, the river folk. I have purchased from you consistently every day of this. Journey. Yes, you have. You've been a very faithful patron. Thank you. So. Don't screw me. Oh no, don't worry. Like things are gonna hey. start getting bloody soon. Vagabond, let's have yeah. a swap meet. I'm curious what the card, what two cards you did not want to give me. He's holding on to things. Yeah, 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 he has something <laughs> in there. I'm so happy to do a swap meet with you. I would yeah. love to get some different cards. I'd card. love to know what he just, uh, master engravers. Perfect. Whenever you Perfect. craft an item, score one extra point. That's pretty big. Ah, if you can get it built, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's pretty, that's great. Um, okay, so. No protectionism. We're not scoring any dividends, unfortunately, because we have no one in our funds, but we do get to gather our funds mm -hmm. back here, and we have plenty to work off of. Excellent. Okay, so let's see what we're gonna do here. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I could. So let me get this right. For dividends, mm -hmm. you could basically pass and score three points. Yes. Interesting. Yes. Yes, I could. I'm not sure when the right time to do that is. I get is. it, but like, that's kind of cool. If you got a pile, kind of holding them could be a big generator. Oh my god, right. I can move through the river to wherever I want. You do have that access. I keep forgetting that. So we're going to go ahead and commit right here to take our... Actually, oh, I don't even need to do that. Um, I'm going to go ahead and establish another trading post. So... Let's go ahead and spend, I'm gonna spend my two otters right here in order to place another mouse clearing right there, which gets, scores me two victory points immediately. Um, after that, we're gonna go ahead and mm. dedicate. Mm -hmm. Has he been scoring points for what he's built so far? No, he hasn't scored anything yet. You okay. have to discard I cards. I discard, I don't, I don't get any points for building. I, I discard cards, that gets me points. These are the tiers for I just wanted to make sure. Yeah, yeah, no. And, okay. and keep in mind, when you start building that next level, it's in the second level, and because you've got one of the earlier printings, I think it shows that you're gonna get an extra card for the next fox clearing. Mm -hmm. In reality, it's a straight line, so it's the next fox, bunny, and mouse clearing. Yeah, and everyone that that's cards. getting the new printing or- are we, are we, But we're playing off of this though, right? Well, no, 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 we're, we're going to play with the, the real printing. rules. Yeah. All right, so okay, so so this this thing here it is, applies is to all of them. Every single one, yeah, oh, and that's important. Okay. So if you back this last kicker, well, that where you're getting today. the new wave in, uh, the key to remember is they actually have board upgrades that they're selling. They're in a really pretty black and mm -hmm. white box. So keep an eye out for that, or grab that off the Leader Game Store page in order to like yeah. upgrade your boards. Yeah, they've got. Um, downloadable sheets you can play where you can yeah. cut out the pieces and tape them to your mm -hmm. existing board. Uh, but just something to keep in mind. No, yeah. got a lot of mice there. Yeah, I'm not sure what I want to do yet. So hey, I think I have a really good card here for the for the river folk. The, what is it? Mirin Broker. Whenever another player crafts an item, draw a card. Hmm. Another wow. player. Hmm. That's pretty powerful. So, I've set my prices, everybody. This is how we're gonna roll for this round. With an open market, that's pretty powerful. Yeah, it's good. Hmm. A lot of mouse cards there. Mm-hmm. Okay. I have a quick question about the birds in the um, thing. So, tell me about it. My hatred of birds <laughs> apparently only count for rituals. I would still disregard birds here, though, right? Right. I can't just pick wild. No, they're not yeah. wild. They never they count for wild count. for you. No. Nope. Yeah. Okay, so looks like outcasts go back to mice. Yep. 
We're gonna discard these bad boys. Yep. And it's um, I now I actually have some things to spend on acolytes. Yes, you do. We do. I could potentially do something here. So, so what are your options there? I can crusade, mm -hmm. so I can spend two of these to battle in any of the outcasts or in any mouse clearings, or I can move from an outcast clearing and battle in the destination clearing, which mm -hmm. does not need to be mm -hmm. a mouse. I can convert, so I can spend two more to remove an enemy warrior and put one of my warriors in its place, mm -hmm. or I can spend all three, which is the other thing I have, and I can remove an enemy building. Okay. And I can put a guard in there. Mm. And that would score him a victory point for removing a building as well, right? Yep. Disgusting. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it depends on who I want to, like, anger first, you know? Yeah, who are you going to piss off? Because this has yeah. been a very peaceful game of Root so, so far. far. There's not been a single dice roll. Also, before you begin, mm -hmm. would you like to partake in any <laughs> any of my excellent wares? You know, the last wear was really good. It was actually so good, I haven't really gone through it yet. Uh -huh. So I may not need a replacement just yet. But mm. thank you for the offer. Well, I do have, just in stock, mm -hmm. I have Master Engravers for you. Does, Whenever you craft an item, you can score no. one extra point. This is how you should play the Otters, though. Uh, right? It's nice. That's, it's a good card. Yeah, yeah. It is good. I'll, I'll, I'll definitely think about it. Also, hey, there's a Vagabond that's really aching to be your friend. And there are mm -hmm. two really coveted items for the Vagabond True. right there. Hey, Vagabond, True. talking about being friends, I just want to remind you of... Uh... I'm, I'm I'm here for that very reason. Uh, Even though just... I realized it was against my better interest, but I am here. And Vagabond, I, a, I, I also have some swords for you. Oh man, I love you guys so much. <laughs> you have no idea. You know what? I'm gonna bank these You're gonna just like now. absolutely be upset with yourself. I'm yourself. gonna bank the acolytes we, for now. We very well might <laughs> You be. might be. What I want to do though, is I want to... Because I don't know much, but I know that when the Vagabond starts getting a lot of stuff, the Vagabond gets really scary. I yeah. want to... Yeah, because your, uh, your ability to cycle quest cards becomes yeah. intimidating. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. So should we not be very friendly? No, 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 no. We, like, I can't no, choose. No, no, no. no, no. Let, me, let me tell you this. Listen, I'm way in behind you. In about a turn, in about I'm, a single turn... We need to stop being friendly. <laughs> okay. In about a turn. You mean like all of us or just with Matt? No, no, no. Like, I'm not talking about us. Okay. We we're we're always friendly. friends. Cool. cool. I'm saying that the Vagabond is almost to the point of game-breaking victory point score. <laughs> oh, okay. I don't like that, that sound. You hear his laugh? That no, I'm like, yeah, sure, guys. I'll yeah. Build yeah. it. We, build because it. Here's, what, here's what happens. When we attack him... He has to exhaust items, which become harder for him to re like re get or break items. Mm -hmm. So we've been very peaceful so far, but the otters and the uh, Marquis de Cat mm -hmm. must work work together. Well, so hey, what, you can always it's recruit still your my turn, men. By the way, oh, Mike, no, you yeah. just I, like, we're go. so sorry, I mean, Mike. You just go. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, I'll remember that. Yeah. <laughs> so I have two cards down. I'm gonna build some more gardens. Ooh, oh, whoa. Okay, so two points. Hmm. No, I don't get two points. No, no, that's. Hmm? I, what do need, you mean? I need to discard oh, yeah. for these two points. I need to start. No, yeah, no, 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 no. Whenever you place these down, you get two points. No. No. Nope. I have, so once it's I have them down, mechanic. I can then discard those cards and I get the points. Yeah, those type of cards. So I can keep repeating it. Every time I discard a card, I get those points. Yep. So. I'm okay, gonna put yeah, that makes sense. A mouse and a bunny. So I'm going to put a mouse. Mm -hmm. Wait, so he can just like win and a bunny. in a turn? Well, I mean, I would need to have. Ooh. I would need, need to put this many gardens down, and, he and then a very do this like full hand. Eight yeah. times, I know exactly. Which I couldn't do in one turn. So yeah. I don't know if I, so but no. you could win in two turns, and they have to match up too. It would be like even at the very end, it would be multiple turns. No, he's gonna have to start. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And I'm at zero now. You so gotta consider he's generated no points yeah, so far. No points. But I have a plan, though. I have a mm -hmm. plan. I have a plan. It might be very good. Don't worry about me. But I'm, I'm just having it. fun selling my stuff. I'm going to throw this fox down. I'm going to put a guy over here. Okay. I don't, hmm. I don't have to own it or anything to put a dude down. Mm hmm And um, I still have these. I'm going to sacrifice one from here and put him right there. Mm-hmm. I'll I keep can't. this one in. That is is the end of my daylight. So the evening I return all my cards. Mm -hmm. I can't believe he gets all his cards back. That's crazy. So there's five. It's really cool. Um, I still I don't have really anything to craft. Well, you would have. Well, I mean, I'm not too worried about it right now, you know? Mm. So I need to draw, then if we're using the revised rules, I need three cards. Yes. 
Here you are, good sir. And I'm gonna start. I need to give me a second to. Oh, because there, this and shows plus yeah. cards now. Yeah, yeah. How, how do you what? How do you remember? Just that row. Oh, just the, just that the, first the, row. The mice. Yeah, yeah. yeah Instead of later on, they moved it forward just a little oh, bit. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna refresh my things. Hey, vagabond, just just in case, just just as a quick reminder, uh -huh. we have a special sale going on. On swords and crossbows. I think technically the I can quintessential get items. Items, I get to refresh five. Okay. The quintessential items two. you need in order to defend I'm yourself. I'm pretty in the sure, woodland. just so you know, that, that it says you can buy at the beginning of your bird, bird song. song. Yes, correct. Which is I you had are nothing. In. Everything was uh, everything was um, uh, was uh, exhausted. Oh. So I had nothing I could buy with. That's a shame. Oh. Well, I will keep this right here for you. Oh, good to know. Yeah, good to yeah. know. Um, Except that somebody else purchases it. You know, it's a free market. So. <laughs> yeah. Anything could happen. So I don't think I'm going to do any slipping right now, but I will go ahead and aid. Oh, thank you. Hey. Wow. And I'll take this. That was unexpected. And so, you know what? I'll aid again. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. How? And I'm going to get two victory points for oh, that. Oh, because you can just do that. And then that. I go up here. You're a good guy. I've said that before, but I'll say it again. But you also said... He's not that nice, to kick his He has no, help no, 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 no. Did you hear that? That's 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 what I thought I heard. I didn't hear no. that. No. No, I never heard it's that. Like Where did you hear that? I, are you kidding me? I, 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 I would never. Hey, hey, this guy comes to my store all the time. I shop would all never, the time with the otters. I would right. never say something like that. Good to know. Ever. Ever. All right, and good part to know. of the woodland. Good yeah. Good to know. Okay. He's a good Samaritan. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, I'm yeah, going to go ahead and exhaust a um, a boot and a tea. Ah. Also, you so move that So that I there. can go ahead and... Um, Oh no! Are you running an uh, errand? Doing, I'm going to run an errand. That's and, a nice thing for him. And that's to do. that's uh, yeah. that's two victory points that's nice right thing. there. Well, hey, he just went up uh, four victory points on, on the track. Two and victory points. Turn. I'm going to go ahead and mm. move on up here. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What if I built something for you this turn? I just, you just just my like. Uh, I, could, I could always come back. Oh, I got that slip. I got so, the slip. So I'm worried that you're going to reveal that ruin and get another item. But that's not what you're going to do, right? I'm going to reveal no, the ruin. Not. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, perfect. It's another uh, What's your carry sack. limit right now, then? A lot. Uh, ten? <laughs> <laughs> Great. And uh, actually, I'm going to go ahead and craft... Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah. Great. Excellent. I'm going to go ahead and craft this uh, mouse in a sack. Well, thank you so very much for that. I'm going to go ahead and dra draw a card. Sure. This goes into that discard. Oh, it's another dominance card. Interesting. And hey, it's a bird card. So you can basically carry as much as you'd like. I can carry the maximum. Mm -hmm. How do you lose items? He doesn't. What? We have to wound him to break them, and then he has to repair them. Yep. And the hammer, conveniently, that he found, or got, or however, uh, is his repair tool. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> so, How many I, items can he repair with a single hammer? Enough! One. Yeah. Enough. Okay! Uh -huh. So hey, Or I can it. slip into the fair forest and repair them all. Uh, it takes a turn, but that's true, that's a thing he could do. So, so hey, uh, cats. Um, I think it's your time to shine. You remember how I was telling you about uh, about our little problem we we're gonna have to address at some yeah, point? <laughs> yeah, it seems like we're there. Uh, my right? turn is over. And hey, I have some great news. <laughs> I have a lot of things to I help. Was coming. I have a lot of things oh, I can help here. Oh my gosh. I so can't many build things. any of them. What do you mean? There's one card here to extend your turn. All I've got is, if you could give me bunny clearings. Oh, that was a good sales tactic. There's one card there to extend your turn. Mm -hmm. And all I have to do is give you two yep. for that. And I've even made my riverboats very limited, so you, we can hop all the way over here I... and damage some items. <sighs> just in case if, you know, if that's what you want to do. I have everything very affordable right now. I... I hate you. Oh my god. So I'm I'm giving you a special a special deal. Uh -huh. it's, it's, it comes with a duck. Uh -huh. Like the duck comes with... Is that yours to give? Yes. Yes. He's actually Quackaloop adjacent, so... Honk honk. It might be. Yeah. It might be. We need a t-shirt that's a goose, and it just says <laughs> it just says duck adjacent or Quackaloop adjacent. <laughs> Close enough. Close enough. Can we that have a honk awesome. somewhere? I like honking. So, so, yeah. So, there we go. So, this is the first thing I'm going to offer you. Oh, you're the worst type of person. 
So the next thing I could potentially give you, right, is my support, my men in your endeavors, my people. Now, men, women, kids, <laughs> anybody you want, we will send to battle for you. He is just- At a moderate price. He is just laying on, I mean, Hey, we we just want to help out everybody. Whew. That's 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 our only I, goal. I will buy this card. Excellent. Your your negotiation tactics. Are you sure you don't want some rivers? You have a lot of good tactical positions here to take control of that mouse clearing. And I'm not going to stop you. Yeah. I mean, you're not wrong. And it's a very we have a good travel plan in place. I do hate buying things from him, though. What do you mean? There's no, you don't lose anything I, from investing I do in my company. Here's the weird balance point. At some point, we've got to punch you in the face. But I also need to punch him in the face. <laughs> <laughs> he requires some more punching right now. Like, I know, like, you've, got the, you've got the just steady pace kind of uh, faction. Everyone else has got the. They're gonna skyrocket. Slow, slow, slow. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and so, like, the balance point of this is becoming very, very precarious yeah. for me. <laughs> and I'm getting, I'm getting very concerned. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, just you know, if if Jan decides to punch me in the face, I might just retreat into the forest and just go ahead and repair there. Jan, uh, here, that'll here, take me out of a round. Here's the thing. I feel like some nests need to be dealt with and some otters need to be dealt with. Mm. I have been a good business person. Gardens? Every day I've come into your shop. Mm -hmm. I think if I deal with some gardens, mm -hmm. maybe you should deal with, uh, with this rabble rouser going around thinking he's the hero. Because uh, I'm more equipped to deal nope. with that and you're more equipped to deal with him. Are, I, am I? I've given you funds to help. Are we sure that? Gardens are so nice. We are. Know, I have zero and here's, points. And here's what I'll do. They're nice okay. to walk around in. Just There's to secure your support mm -hmm. on this next round, mm -hmm. I'm going to pay for one of your men to help me. No, that's two. Mercenaries? Oh. That's a high price to pay. I don't want to pay for are that. Are you sure for three, for three guys? No, I can't. Also, you can't move my guys. It's it's dependent. So if you I can't tell move me, them? No, no, you don't get to move them. Oh, so if I you could. tell I me, can. if you tell me where you want to go, I will be there in time uh, to aid you. Gotcha. In a round. I forgot right. to draw my cards, didn't I? I get no. to draw three cards. And discard down. You did forget to do yep. that. Yep. One. Yeah. Two. Okay. I I'm going to do. I'm gonna deal with what I've gotta deal with. Okay. Gosh. Oh gosh, this has gone on too long. <laughs> this is just horrible. All right, fine. I'm hiring your men. Okay. Wait, bring... they, they can't come with me. Why yes. am I hiring you men? They can't move. I, I said, well, oh, they're you here. can hire them there, yeah. It's a five against, five against one is pretty great odds to, F up a few items over there. It's two. Two to hire your men? <laughs> yes, we just went through this. Yep, you did. I promise I will give them back to you very, very soon. Oh my god. I gosh. promise. I'm, oh my gosh. All right. I shouldn't have done that. I'm doing it. Mm. Place one wood at each sawmill. Wood, wood. Oh man, that's a lot of wood. Move down. Uh, take three actions plus one per bird card you spend. Battle, march, recruit, build, overwork. I'm going to start with... This is really difficult. I'm gonna start with a march action. I can take two moves, but the only people that can really reach here, where your people are recruited to deal with him. You can use a move, move right there. And then I empty that, and that yes. becomes very vulnerable. Hmm. Moving two into that spot. So now we have four. Yeah, we've got four. I'm then going to do, oh, I'm actually, oh, I hate leaving that spot open. 
If I move three, I can build, recruit, and then fight, but that doesn't matter because it, it's not enough to do damage. Let's go ahead well, and- Well, right now you rule it. Like right now I you don't. rule do it. Do I rule it with him? Yes. Do I over- You would rule. Yeah. Oh, I do rule. Yeah. Because his mercenaries are gonna give you rule. Mm-hmm. Oh. That's, 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 that's what you're paying for. Okay. So let's go ahead and spend three wood immediately then. Two, well, I'll spend two from this other one and one from that one to go ahead and build this. Question is, where do I want to build this? Bunny, mouse, bunny benefits me. It's mouse. You know what I mean. <laughs> you know, they're really similar. I get them screwed up all the time, so. Yeah, and mouse and bunnies. Let's the same uh, animal. They both have like biggish ears. You Practically know? the same thing. These foxes have like kind of big ears. Let's go to war. Too. Let's Show do it. it. Yes. Vagabond. Listen, I I only have, I don't have any, all I only have is bunny cards out there. Two, three. Ooh. All right. So, you're taking three damage. Okay. You need to break three items. So okay. Jesse, just so that you're aware, mm -hmm. when we're taking casualties, mm -hmm. you must do it in odds. So it's one and one. So one and one. Yeah. And then one? No, no, no. Oh, no, we only take two damage. Oh, one and one. Yeah. And so it's always yours? rounded up. There's mine. No, yeah. you don't have to. You, you, I only can do one damage. Oh, you can only do one? Only he only sword. has the so sword. So that, it's only me. So I, only, I only got his damage. Yeah. And here's the thing. Right? He's, you're probably going to the forest, is my thought. Probably. But he left a hammer a torch, a kettle, and a sword. He could strike back. You did damage to us too, right? So we go to enemies. You took you took his off. Uh, I took him off. You wanna check the rules on this? Yeah, I think that it would, I would think it would be you, but I don't know. Check, check what happens, cause this is important. So, um. It says here, they must split hits between their own pieces and river folk warriors. So you get to choose that initial split, mm -hmm. right? Okay. But I'm thinking about going again. Okay. Because that was what, my second action? Yes. While you moved, what? no, no, no. You oh, I moved, built. Built, I could, I could push it though. Which, yeah. With that dominance card yes. you bought, so. Yes, exactly. You would essentially be killing off my men, though. Which is I funny. feel like it would be. I, I feel like it's got to be him that goes hostile. Mm -hmm. That could be pretty good for for us too. Like if when well, you split hits, he starts scoring victory points when you when you hit him. If I split hits and I go oh, hostile, hostile as well. Yo, Jesse, is it your turn yet or what, dude? <laughs> Sick burn. I, Damn. We're gonna have to come after the lizards in just a second. You whoa. That's my Whoa. The <laughs> okay. lizards are kinda down uh, there for now. Right? I am You're gonna I am gonna go ahead and push this. Yes. So I dominance <laughs> is going to enter kind of an option that you could pull. You could pull that dominance. I'm gonna push it so that I can do I'm gonna push it so that I can do another recruit. Or I, I might do a build. I'm gonna push it so I can do another build option. Okay. Did you just discard something? It was a dominance card. It's a dominance. I, yeah, I, we don't think it goes to your. Priority. And it's a bird anyway, so it won't. Uh, it won't go. It would technically, but it won't. Yeah, it doesn't make a difference. Um, mm -hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and build. This is gonna cost two to place this down right here. Uh, that's gonna score me two more victory points. Then I'm going to continue pushing it. I'm. Get, getting rid of an ambush, which does go to the discard pile. Okay. Uh, and I'm gonna push that in order to recruit. So I recruit here, here, um, I believe I have one more, yes, right here. We might have to do something about these cats, guys. I don't think so. Look at them. I don't think so. I then- You're all scary. Let me just put it like that. <laughs> I'm just trying to sell my wares, man. That's all we're doing. Okay, I've done everything I can do. Uh, I'd love it if you'd, you'd help uh, kind of deal with those lizards. Um, Sounds like he needs to deal with those cats. I'm gonna actually. come to evening, I draw Dude, two look cards. look at victory points. Yeah, I think you need to hit some. Look at I my think you need to hit those points. cats. And I need, to to hit the cats. I need to discard down. 
Of course he wants you to deal with the uh, with the, the lizards. Because it's just a matter of not dealing with the cats. So I'm discarding this one I know. Mm -hmm. I'm discarding this one I know. Which would not go here, would actually go over there. It's another dominance card that's available for everyone, Well, right? when it goes discarded, it goes to there first. Oh, so it that card would also... Was but it? it's, a, it's yeah. a bird, it doesn't really matter. Well, it still it still yeah. goes there. It doesn't go yeah, to yeah, the yeah. side until and after I'm discarding it goes this discards. One. Okay, that is the uh, the end of my turn. Oh man, so many bunnies. Okay, so my turn. It is your turn. Okay, so we just moved directly to the gather funds. Mm-hmm. Hmm, this is interesting. So I did say that I would give you some warriors back, but you did you lied. No, no, it's not that I lied. It's now that I'm worried about what you'll do. We we were doing the plan you set in place. No, yeah, but I need some things in place before. But we're then, doing but the then plan you, you but set then you in place. Like, got a gorillion victory points, which kind of like changed things. Yeah. No, 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 I am the slow and steady. Halfway here is like a turn for you. A turn, okay. Could be. Hmm. Just like the Corvid, you can win out of nowhere. Okay, so sure. I'll be, I'll be dedicating so that I can establish rule right here, which gives mm. me one, two. How does that give you rule? Uh, so if we're friendly, like if we've been trading and I have your guys here, I can immediately just conquer this one or that one. Actually, I will be conquering this. No, yeah, I will I'll keep that one. Okay. Uh, but how do you, you don't get rule. No, 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 I'm sorry, not rule. I just get, you get a garrison a trade in the post. trade post. Yes. build there, okay. Mm -hmm. I was gonna say rule seems very Rule specific. is incorrect, yes. Yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and dedicate in order to build Master Engravers. Mm -hmm. And then after that, we're gonna go ahead and dedicate right here so that we can build a crossbow. My guys are doing a lot of work for you. And whenever you craft an item, you score one extra point. So I just gained two more points. Right here, one, two. Mm -hmm. um, and so I'm gonna dedicate one more person so that I could draw a card. Yep. Into the marketplace. Ooh, root Ooh, tea. Root tea. And uh -oh. there is a kettle left. Mm hmm. Oh, wait, this doesn't go here anymore. No, no, it actually goes to the mm -hmm. discard. Okay. Um, and I think I can't really do much else this turn. I need to prepare. Um, I really need to start dedicating some funds permanently. Mm hmm. I think that's it, everybody. Okay. Okay. Well, there's. Um a lot of bunnies, so that'll be my new outcast. Throw that guy right there, these can go to discard. Shoot them down. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right, now it's time for my uh, conspiracies. I have some funds to spend on conspiracies. I was mm -hmm. hoping I could stay with the mice, but and have some more. So let's take a quick look at this board, see if I don't want to do anything. Everything still seems a little expensive to me. In my head, I kind of want to like, Oh, you just, you, you mean just me? cost yourself a riverboat mm. uh, butt thing. All right, all right, I see. I'm not lowering your mat. Okay. Hmm. Well, that's all right. It's not for you, anyways. Some interesting crosstalk. This always seems to happen on your turn. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> you have to think out loud, you know. He's a very pensive player, mm -hmm. so there's space for that. I'm going to convert. Mm -hmm. Okay. To What's that? People. Oh, to remove an enemy warrior in an outcast clearing and place a warrior there. Do you have a enemy Bunnies. in an outcast? Yeah, I'm gonna spend oh. all of these and I'm gonna replace the two corners with mine. Take You so. can't do it there, because oh, my it keep there? is okay. there. You could do this corner. So I'll spend two mm -hmm. to replace it there. Watch out for the dominance. Hmm. So now I own that, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, we do. We got to get those dominant cards out of here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pull them out. When I crusade to do just battle, them, uh... can I attack a building for crusades, or is that just other pieces? No, any. I think it's battle in any outcast that clearing, or may move from me. any outcast clearing, and then may battle and battling a target to any tokens there, right, Matt? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you. So can. I can battle that here yep. in the. And you would gain a victory point, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Because he's also defenseless. So I want to I battle your smithy. I guess. Okay. To spend two more. Yeah. So you need to still roll because you could get potentially zero zero. Okay. Yeah, yeah, but even if he does, it's it's. I. Uh, oh, he has plus one. 
Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. So just can like, I play an ambush at the top go ahead. of? Yep. Wait, the, even if he doesn't have pieces there? That's what I'm asking. There's no one ambush. Oh place. no. Okay. So I still need to roll. I don't think so. Whatever. We'll, yeah, we'll like, play it now. <laughs> Pretty close. <laughs> okay, so that's um, uh, one point. That is one point. Yep. Yay on the board. <laughs> All right, and that ends the conspiracy phase. Yeah. The bird song. Woo! Now it's time for daylight, huh? Let's see what's going on here, guys. Hmm. I, want I didn't like to... that. That felt bad. Yeah, you kind of you're probably hitting a a snag right now in your play. You need some friends. I'm your friend. I have otters. Yeah, but they're very expensive. <laughs> the otters are expensive. What do you need? What do you need? I need help. What you, want, play... what you don't need is enemies right now. You can't move that. I'm gonna play a fox. Now? You set your prices at the start. Oh. Well. And I'm gonna with this fox. I'm gonna put down a guard in here. Sure. Okay. Yeah, he's already made his decisions. Mm-hmm. And um, because it would be unfair to the top of his. Turn. I'm gonna keep this mm-hmm. here, and then I'm gonna play all. I'm going to then spend. Uh, all of these mm-hmm. for six points. Yes, you are. Wait, what? Yep. Yes, you are. Those go there. That is what we were saying about those lizards. Oh, I'm so proud of you. <laughs> oh, Lord, that was terrifying. Uh huh, and that can so start. So, return happening. this card to my hand, and I need four cards. So, mm, I don't think I should say anything. I'm not going to say anything, right? I shouldn't say anything. I'm don't say, say a say thing. Anything. Don't say a thing. Mm hmm. Okay. All right. But, but Jesse, what what if um no? <clears throat> I shouldn't. It's up to you, buddy. Uh, what does he get if he if I reveal this? I don't know what you're talking about. Uh huh. Okay. <laughs> My turn. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. All right. So I get to refresh three items, and I will be refreshing the tea. Mm-hmm. So so before before we keep the going, torch. He's already started refreshing. Oh. Past his turn. Um, and he knows what he's. Yeah, you already took it out of my price range anyway. Yeah. You made everything two. I told you that if you do everything two, then we're done. What do you mean? He tries a hard I had one thing that was unrefreshed. Mm-hmm. I could spend one. You made everything two. Mm-hmm. So when you moved your, made your river boats, something else. It was too far. It's like, you just lost the sale, buddy. Mm-hmm. Um, Interesting. Got a little greedy, my friend. Got, got a little greedy. You know? No, I do, I do. That It's been told before. Mm-hmm. We have to watch for fluctuations much more. Uh, focusedly. And then... Focus. Focus. That's not a word. Focusedly? Yeah, that's not a word. It's good enough. (laughs) It's added flavor. Exactly. Lizards. What's up? We got no beef, right? I don't have any beef. Alright, I'm gonna come spend some time with you. Mm. I'm gonna fly with my glide power over to that bunny clear. Like an eagle. Whoa. Pew! Nice little somersault that you made over there. Hey. Hey. I could even... You know what? I could even aid you. Do you have anything to... Oh, you don't have anything I could build, though. No. No, that's just too bad. That's too bad. Um, so I'm not... eh. Can you 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 have two gardens in the same clearing? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm gonna aid you, okay. just for that one point. And who knows? Maybe you'll build that thing I just gave you. I'm going to fix something. I will fix one of my um, boots. Mm-hmm. And I think that that is gonna have to be the end of my turn. Oh, <sighs> unless, I mean, it's weird, but I could help you by killing Are you. you. River boats? Which I put for you. I mean, it wouldn't be you an aggressive action, but I could do it. You could, yeah. I mean, it would be the worst like, thing. It depends on where it was. I'm spread, gonna, I'm spread a little so thin, though. Can... If I attacked you right... I mean, I don't want to do anything you don't want me to do. I mean, I only have one guy there, so... I mean, it, I like to retain control, you know. Well, you, you know, you still got, you got control. You got those gardens there. Yeah. I mean, right now, getting one more accolade wouldn't help me too much. No. All right. Yeah. Right, I, if I have any say in it, I think I'd like to keep that guy there for now. All right. well, He's I, not ready to be sacrificed. All right, well, you, you don't have any say in it. I'm going to yeah. attack you. All right. So this wow. was... Wow. And then it's now here, right? Yeah. So I got, a, I got a victory point for it. And now, right, you gave me the victory point. That's oh, the, you already that's got it. it. You already yeah. got it, yeah. All right. Get in that tray. 
Zero two. Okay, so he comes off, goes to the acolyte. You cycled your sword to do that? I did. Mm-hmm. Goes to the acolyte. Okay. And now you're hostile. Mm-hmm. Okay. And that's going to be the... And, you know, I, I know you didn't want me to do that, yeah. but, you know... But, I mean, hey, I mean, we could always... I always figured it'd be good to make you hostile anyway, yeah. just because it's going to mix things up. Mm-hmm. Is it my turn? It's your turn. Okay. I have to I have to draw my cards, but you go ahead and do that. So, sure. We have a lot of things to talk about here. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh, I hate your prices. They're not that bad. His they're like are lower. Bad. They're lower than than they're half. They're half off. It could be at four. I usually sell these at four at peak season. No, wait, not this one. On the sword. No, this one. Okay. This one. I took it. Okay. You sure you don't want some river boats? I'm okay without river boats. Place okay. one wood each. One there, one there. I believe that's all the mills I have built. Mm-hmm. Craft. Using workshops. Yeah. That yeah. is what I'm doing. Uh, you destroyed one of my bunny workshops, mm-hmm. but I still do have a rabbit workshop. So, this is going to the discard. I gain two victory points for that. And I get that kettle, which you might still like. I would still like that <laughs> kettle. You would. There's no doubt about that. Is that. A, uh, that is not a shabby piece of manufacturing. That's a good thing for me. It is. Uh-huh. It is. I now can take up to three actions I feel plus drawn. one. I feel drawn to <laughs> you now. bird I spend. I am going to start with a recruitment action. One two, three. Hmm. Hmm. I am then going to take a march action. One, two. We are then going to do a battle action here in the clearing against Oof. the lizards. Last place. Last nice. plus one. Eat it up only. Sorry about that. Exactly two. So one plus one. Exactly two is going so to clear two these points. guys off. That is going to be two points there in the clearing. Sorry, I made you defenseless there. It's, it's okay. Kind of my fault. Um, But I had to get there so that yep. you could trade with me for that kettle. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you did. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm not <laughs> actually able to overwork. I will drop two cards. I will deal with my discard as Jan begins his turn. So, hey. Hey. Lizard folk. Mm-hmm. I think we are. Uh, it's about time we do a swap meet. Okay. So I'm gonna give you this card. Go ahead mm-hmm. and shuffle yours a little bit till you feel comfortable. What about this card? No, oh, yeah, that one's up. Uh... I'm not looking. All right. We ready? Yeah. Let's go ahead and take this one. All right. Add these. Hey, oh. The that is a wonderful card. Oh, I kind of like this one too. Also, oh, these go here. Okay. Perfect. So, hmm, we have some mighty fine things. So first of all, we're going to gain a point because we had some funds there Mm -hmm. that we held on to. And we're going to move all these things up here. I'm going to move all those things down there. So that's... There's a ruin there. What is it? There's a ruin there. There is, in fact, a ruin there. Not yet. And you probably have a sense of what you haven't collected yet. Mm Mm-hmm. So next thing we're gonna do is that we are going to give you back two guys. Thank you. In order to build another clearing right here, uh, which gives me two more points. And now we're going to use that in order to craft. So I'm gonna dedicate two of your guys right there so that we can go ahead and craft a sword, which will now give me three points because I have master engravers, which Mm -hmm. whenever I create an item, I score one more point, so one, two, and three. Then, <laughs> yeah, that actually makes a lot of sense. We're going to dedicate three so that we can bring three guys right here. <laughs> <laughs> and, wow. then, and then we're going to initiate a basura. Three, one, wow. So that's one out, plus another one, so that's one victory point. Mm-hmm. And, and I lose one, one, one guy. Okay, 
And that is, uh... The lizards are tough to play. All she wrote, <laughs> especially, are tough especially to when play. a when a turn that gets you six points scares people and they start mm -hmm. attacking you, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that makes them even harder to play. <laughs> the lizards are just a rough faction. I don't I don't know how to win with them. Mm. And that's uh, that's uh, it for me. Okay. We we kind of punched him in the face there. I didn't expect Jan to come in with a hard swing as well. Yeah, that was pretty rough, man. <laughs> I, uh, I'm sorry. I, I was. I, I sitting here in the back, I, like just minding my own business. It was the only I points did. I saw. You there. set yeah, it that's up. Fine. So... I, I'll remember this. I'll remember. That's cool. <laughs> hey, I just gave you a card you could use. That's true. <sighs> All right. So it's my bird song. Check so hey Matt, oh. I have three mice and three foxes. <laughs> Why do you always talk during his turn? I'm sorry. Which, which ones do I pick now? Do I? I believe you can choose. Yeah, they're tied. I'm going to go with uh, the mice. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we're going to discard this action. Thank you, kind sir. Let's see what We've we got going on here. Gone through the deck. I am going to... Are you going to use your conspiracy at all? Still thinking. I'm going to spend three acolytes to destroy your mouse smith there. What? I can destroy an enemy building in outclass and place a guard in there. You yep. don't. In an outcast um, clearing. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, and place a guard in there. That doesn't seem necessary. So he gains a point. But you yeah, lose this. I didn't that. do anything to you. Thanks, man. <laughs> there we go. So, and now it's time for daylight. I am going to recruit. Oh, God. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to put one here in this box. Ooh. And then two here in this box. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. You know, one thing he's not benefited from, we haven't waged a lot of war early on in this game. And these guys like being killed. And yeah. You know, another thing that they could have benefited on? Mm. Paying me things so that we could work together. But they've only <laughs> dedicated <laughs> Shut one. Up. Shut up. It's true. <sighs> There's so many great things out there. And I'm going to put down. It is true. You can like pay them for the rule of a clearing, mm -hmm. which can benefit you a lot. Although he's not giving, he doesn't have a lot of rule out there. Mm -hmm. Hasn't really been pulling his weight in that regard. Yeah, if we'd been, if he'd been butting up with us a little bit more, but I pulled back from him initially, I'm gonna yeah. spend which I think bunny, probably made it hard for him to get down started. There. Down here. Down at the end. Yep. Thank down. you. Ooh, I am. Hmm. I'm in rough shape way down here at the uh And then nine I'm going mark. to sacrifice both of them in the corner. Mmm. Two alkalites. Yeah, it's good for you to have them. I smell another conspiracy. Well, you're of punching ruin. me in the face, really. So I'm gonna take all these back. me down. Now that I've done my that done that part, um I own Two fo so I'm, a, I'm still like a little One, weird two. on the crafting system. If I own two foxes, I can craft a two fox thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do I still have that card? Or did he take it? Maybe he took it. I don't remember. I took one item card and then yeah, I gave it, it back was... to you to to the outcast. So yeah, I think I probably yeah you yeah I did it. take it. Yeah, I did. So this is basically a free action then. Oh, I discard this if I use it, right? Mm hmm. I don't have to discard though. You might as well just craft it. Yeah. He has them over five anyway right now. I'm going to craft this. So that's two. Okay. And he takes the last hammer. He does. So there's only a sword and a coin purse available to craft left. Mm -hmm. so this, this I wonder where all the and other get, items went. Two points for that, right? Yeah. Yes, I already gave Perfect. them to you. Thank you. All right, and I'm going to draw three cards, and I get to start to five. Damn. That's so cool that you get to feed your own system. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then if I get the here, I think I draw even more, hmm. which is pretty that's wild. Awesome. Such a neat okay. action. Okay, leave it on the mat. I'm gonna shuffle and reset this deck. So, hey, I do have some things if you're interested in them. Yeah, I got zero. Mm. Uh, not the cards. Huh? I'm uh, not pointing at the cards. No. It, I have to spend, I have to He's exhaust nothing, items. Though. I've got nothing I can exhaust. Oh. So, uh, like I'm, going to, I'm going to refresh five items. I told you I'd help. It's true. You did say that. And I did help. You did help. That hammer is awful nice up there. So is that tea that I got, though. 
A T's not bad. Also but that a crossbow hammer. and a and a sword. So you can get back of those pesky cats. Alright. First things uh, first. I mean, we're, we're still first on things his first, team. I want what's in there. Yeah. Ayo. That's so you a don't, sword. So you don't really need the sword. Nah, the sword's not bad at all. I mean you don't really need Jan's sword. Of course, no. she shoddy, needs more it's swords. Shoddy work. The otters make poor swords. No, hey, we have the best craftsmanship anyway. I've I've done deals with you for years. I would never buy a sword from you. What do you uh, mean? What how, about that first sword I gave you? Years. You have you your people use our swords. What do you I mean? sold it to right. vagabond. I am going to move. Despicable. Oh wait, At a lower price. Yes, I have to move. Really I'm going tell. to move over into that fox clearing with Jesse. You're already in a clearing with me. Yeah, but I have to go to the fox clearing to uh, so that I can give you for the tea aid one time. So is which that gives me the three points? No, oh, I have to tea. aid him three times. So hey, you can also aid me right and here. And there's two times, and here's three times. No, for me or for Jesse. And that gives me up to allied oh. status, and that gets me mm -hmm. two points. No, so no aid for me. I'm the only person he can benefit from aid at this point. Because he's, uh, and now it actually, it's actually not bad for him to keep me there. Because he could teach, he could, you could treat my warriors as mm -hmm. your own, and he'd gain every time he aids me. So, so, so okay, so since we're hostile, we never get to, he can never be friends with us can't again? Can't pull you back up that track, no. Uh, I'm going to go ahead, well, if we were to form a coalition, we'd go to, um, like neutral. Neutral. I'm going to aid you to get two more points. Okay. That's a lot of cards you got there. That's a decent amount of points he just got too, though. Mm-hmm. And five in total, right? No, four. I think I will repair that crossbow that I have. And then... You know, otters have a soft spite. Right underneath their... Uh, hey, 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 I told you that in confidence. But you like being tickled there. That's why I was sharing it. He, I figured he could come yeah, so I don't think he's going to scratch. I don't think he's going to tickle our, our people. Can I have, we are going... Actually, go ahead and roll your fate. We're moving with... We're battling with uh, my allies here. Wait, you're killing us? The battling, otters? He's battling with me versus you. Because he has me full ally. What do you mean? We're friends. I, I thought we were friends. I have no choice in the matter. One, one. All right, so. Okay. So I'll lose a sword there. You will. Do it again. Oh, come on, Matt. Uh, you do have another sword, don't you? Two, uh, one. Two, one. So it's one, one equivalent, equivalently, right? Because all you have is one sword left. Well, this, so it would be, um, no, no, no. So basically, if he does damage to me, so you lose one, right? I did, yes. Um, and we did two to him? We mm -hmm. did two to him. Oh, okay. Would he lose one or two? Oh, he would lose two. Because I'm, I'm doing damage with your guy and yeah. my swords. Not just the, not, both of these swords. Okay. So, so I, it's like, I've got two damage I can do, plus all your guys. So he's wiped out. Okay. And did you give me the proper points? I did. I gave you one point for that token. Well, hey, I just oh, want to let you know. Oh, a point per, you, you killed well, two of his people, right? I did, but so, I don't get to count the points until, so the, oh no, he was already hostile. Yes. So I killed two of his people, and then did you get it for that token too? I yes. did, yes, so okay. three total. Yep. That was a massive turn for him. That's not, that's not a bad turn for him. No, that wasn't too bad, not too shabby. That's uh, seven points in a single turn. Not gonna complain. FYI. Not gonna complain about that. I wouldn't know why you would. I'm not going to. Yeah. Yeah, I'd see no reason for you. Uh, that's uh, that's the end of my turn. I'm going to draw my cards. I get to draw, what, uh, three? Mm -hmm. One. Top two. of my turn. So my wares are cheap. My mercenaries are cheaper. There's a lot of things you can take. Your wares are $2. Oh, my wares, but everything else is pretty affordable. Your wares... And you, and you sir, have access to all of my wares. There's only one single sword in this entire game, so, you know, two dollars isn't that much of an ask. Your wares seem to be a bit expensive for my need, taste. Well, if you say so, that's two points. Um, the river, though, is really easy. 
to use. And so are my mercenaries, in case you wanted them, you know. I do not think I'll be buying your rares. Uh, mm -hmm. Place one wood at each mill. So that gives me a total, yeah, I have a total of, of four. four wood on the board. Craft, using workshops. I have one card that I can craft that's gonna be False Orders. Uh, in Birdsong, may discard this card to move half of the enemy's warriors rounded up from any clearing, treating yourself as that player and ignoring rule. I'm gonna move this over here because I got tunnels active as well. Uh, three actions. Battle March, Recruit, Build, Overwork. I would like to start with a build action. I'm going to spend two wood to go ahead and build a mill. Do you get those points again? I do. So I'm scoring two points. I then would like to go ahead and do a recruit action. Right? Yes. One. 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 I'm going to go ahead and do a second build action, building a lumber mill. I'm going to place it right here. It's going to be two more points. Um, and that'll take these two lumber off. And that's it? That's three? That is not it. Mm -hmm. I would like to go ahead and push myself. I'm going to attack for an easy victory point. <laughs> uh, the otters, right here. Really? <laughs> two, one. I'm losing one. You're losing two. Oh, I should have targeted a fox. Where's his fox, boys? Where's he? Got? So take your victory point for that. Where's you got? Where you got two foxes out? Aren't those supposed to go back? Those are supposed to be back on your board. Nope. They get. They disappear forever. Yeah, they count. They go, they go away. And he can still use those areas. To oh build? yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh. Yeah, that's pretty powerful. Disgusting. Did oh, I can me... still use the areas. Oh yeah. Did you give me a uh, victory point? Yes. So just he just so. has to get them crafted and then. Yep. Oh. He just has to get them out there. Gross. Okay. I believe that is everything I can do. I'm going to draw up two cards and then I'm going to discard down. So Jan, I gotta say I really Guys, didn't like you gotta, that. You gotta really go after Jesse here. He's getting really nasty. I really didn't like that. It was necessary. Oh, was it? Okay, mm -hmm. we'll see how necessary it was. Okay, um... So, hey, Jesse. Mm -hmm. Does he get the victory points if the item is not available? No, you can't craft if the item's okay. not there. Okay, hey, let's do swap meet. Well, the item I've is there. I've got to discard down yeah, first. That item is there. Yeah. Oh, it won't be. Yeah, he's gonna, oh, okay. he's gonna build it. I need to discard down first, however. So so first, let's go ahead and do that. Um, I'm gonna dedicate two here in order to build this card. So you get right. that. I take this. Birds, very exciting, much excite. And I gain three victory points, so one, two, and three. Okay, I'm discarding those four. Okay. I believe that's what I wanna do. And uh, your swap meeting? Yep. Oh, interesting. Even. Oh. <laughs> Here we go. Okay. Ooh, excellent. Okay, so we're doing that. So we have recruited four there, and we're gonna go ahead and commit to a battle. Mm -hmm. Who are you fighting? You. Why? <laughs> I'm not gonna answer that. So that's one zero. Mm -hmm. We're gonna go ahead and commit again. Ambush. What? You lose two immediately. Okay, that's fine. It don't really matter. And I and you rolled before I was able to react the first yeah, he's time. Doing it the, he's doing it now. I'm just saying, like right, he yeah. rolled before that's fair enough. I was able to think through, could I do the first one? I, yeah, he's, he's fast like that. That's three, I'm, two. But what I'm saying is I would have played the first one if I wasn't so discarding. two and two. So that's no, no, one can more I clarify? I would have played mm -hmm. another one if I wasn't discarding when he rolled. No, you were, that was before Oh, you I have did two that. ambushes? Yes. Oh, yeah, then, yeah, you yeah, see yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, absolutely, I totally agree with you. Okay. Yeah. Because I was in the process of handing you cards when he rolled. That was pretty quick, The yeah. first time. So, ambush two, 
would actually result in you not being there and me still being there. Yep, that's right. Okay. Because I I've God literally held it. those the entire mm -hmm. game. No, no, no. That's fair for a play. I think that's correct. Okay. Mm. Damn you. Okay. Well, I mean, if you had an ambush in your hand, you could just play that too. That's and... true. I don't have any. Oh. <sighs> okay. Yeah, I'm done. Okay. On to uh. Okay. Mm. So it looks like uh, the wolves will be the next outcast. Yes, they will. Foxes? Yeah, whatever. Same thing. I mean... They're pretty close. Unless you ask the wolves. I guess. Yeah, they, they'd probably be offended <laughs> by that. All right, um, conspiracies. Mm -hmm. It's approaching the end game here. I might want to spend these. Yeah. I'm going to spend two acolytes. Mm -hmm. I'm going to switch out your dude here with the fox one. No, oh, God. So I control that. It's kind of rude. And that's two easy victory points. Oh no, you can't. You can't I attack. Can't attack. Yeah, you can't. You yeah. can't move or attack without uh, yeah. acolytes. That's why us not killing his people has kind of been yeah. a damper on his game. He could discard a ton of cards now, though, if he had them. Yeah, I could. Couldn't I? Mm -hmm. Darn it, Jesse! Yeah. You win next round, don't you? I don't think so. Might not. I mean, can we get in and destroy his wood? I don't have any wood, and I'm only gaining two per round, so I literally can't build. Yeah, well, I tried taking him down a peg, and you saw what happened. He had two ambushes for me, and I lost everyone. <laughs> His sob story is very, uh... <laughs> what sob story? It's the truth. Didn't you see it? No, but just the way you said it was, I'm gonna uh... play these two. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna take, um, a recruit and a build over there in the corner. Recruit and build? Okay. And then I'm going to discard... These three. Now, do you get points for that? No, you don't. You're discarding three. So and that's six. giving you how many so points? points? Another six points. So yeah. 10 to 16. Okay. Nice. So I'll take these back. I get uh, three cards. I love how Jan's freaking out when he's Actually, literally next to me on the victory point track. I'm not freaking out. I know. It's just that it sucks that you have two ammo, yeah, so but I'm take, not freaking out. I need three cards and I'm, and I'm done. Okay. I don't have to draw down. All right. So me, huh? Yes, sir. I'm going to aid you. Oh, thank you. So, Matt, before and you that's do... that's two points. It is. This is the last one that's available, just yep, FYI. It's the last one. And I don't sure think enough. you have sure of anything. I flip. guess I could have flipped this. But it's damaged. It's damaged. I couldn't use it, but I could exhaust it. Uh -huh. uh, that's okay. I don't want it. Um, so, that, did you give me my two victory I points? I did, yes. Okay, now... Uh, I get to refresh all my stuff. And now I want to see what's in... Well, I know what's there. Mm. You checking the ruin? Uh, let me think. Do I want it? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, you're good. I will exhaust a boot in a bag. Ah. Let's take a point. The rare quests. How many is that? Just one? This is one. Okay. I will exhaust a torch <coughs> and a kettle. Mm -hmm. How many That's is that? going to be two. So I have it retconned anything. Could I please no. retcon one thing? Not at this point. <laughs> Why not? It's too late in the it's game. It's pretty far. No. We're an I hour. I haven't retconned anything. But we're an hour and a half deep in the game. Close, it was t five minutes we're ago. Close, we're close to end game. It was five minutes ago. Uh, we're so close to end game. We are what are you? What are you trying to retcon? Just for I, I'm not gonna say it, but I want to retcon one thing. No, it, it's not, super simple. Not at this point. It's just rearranging prices. Not at this point. Nope. I am going to attack lizards. Okay. Mm -hmm. Where are you attacking them? Down here. Yeah, right. Where the only place where I can. Oh, this one right here. Mm -hmm. So I get it. Uh, yeah, good. Yeah. Interesting. So that's perfect. Oh. One. Okay. Uh, I am going that to attack. <laughs> so did you give me a point for that? Why? Because I, he's mm -hmm. hostile. Oh, got it. Mm -hmm. I'm going to attack uh, Jesse. Mm -hmm. Yep. Take him out. How many? One. All of them. All of them? Yep. It's one, two. And that makes you hostile. 
<laughs> Don, <laughs> you're Don, like you just better, in time. You, you better believe, better believe it. it. <laughs> <laughs> Whew. Um, and I guess that's. I guess like I can do this. Mm-hmm. And that's it. That's it. Then I have to. Then I get to draw my three. Okay, down to the Marquise. Okay, at the top of my turn, I would like to buy. God damn it! From no, the... that's why you said no. Yes, 100%. I gave Jesse the game. One hundred percent. That's why I said no. No, but that's not fair. No, I it is before. I also noticed that you didn't set your prices accordingly, and I only had one thing in my hand that you drew up. So no way you're retroacting that. <laughs> Jesse won. I gave him no the game. No way. Uh, I don't know if I won. Yes, you did. I don't. I'm not sure. There's no way you don't win. Ooh. I already did my math, and I, w I win with that card. You did the math? All right. So top, I am drawing wood. One, two Damn on wood. Damn it. Damn it. I am, oh. in fact, able to go ahead and build the last item, which is going to be the uh, One, protection two, three. racket. Three. Yeah, so I'm, what, three points away? Yeah, Jesse, there's no way you don't win it. Okay, well, let's see if I can get there. I think that other let's one goes see. into my discard pile, too. That bunny one. Bunny one? Just got discarded. Yeah. Oh, I'm so pissed. Okay, discard I can take police. three actions. I can, uh, I can build over work. So, I believe... You have two wood. I do have two wood. So that's two points for sure. I was glad that you uh, you removed some buildings for me because it opened the door for me to build a little bit cheaper. Um, so I'm going to start with a simple build action. That's going to be two wood for oh. a workshop. Do I have a place to play it? I do. There's an open spot right there. So it's two more points. Yeah, and just take out my guys and that's it. You win. Right uh, here. I don't have to take out your guys. I can attack the. Oh, uh, even easier. No yeah. I can attack the. No one's noticed for like Man. four turns. I've been drawing more cards from it. Go ahead and wipe that's the worms it. out. That's it. Yeah. Clean. Oh, that's it. God, damn it's. It. I think it's tough to win with the cats. Well done. Thank you so much. That's the first time. This is the first time I've played the cats. Yeah. Yeah. I. I always. They're usually like the more straightforward mm -hmm. item. And so whenever we play, I'm usually the teacher and I hand them off to people who want to play weird. Mm -hmm. So in this game, I think I was maybe the most likely to win. The Vagabond, the, the Lizards, and the Riverfolk Company are hard teams to play. Mm -hmm. So I don't know that, mm. but I feel like I played a pretty good game with them. Mm -hmm. um, I, I was. I would have won if I didn't. If I didn't, would you have paid? You would have paid for. I would have paid whatever you'd price. Yeah. For that, um, but but I, I couldn't let you retroact it. It was too. It was a turn from end. Yeah. No, it's like, fine. If you were, in, you, you would have still sure won. Had I had one more turn, I probably could have got. If it. I could have used that card, I would have done it too. I would have done that. Gone ahead and taken out your guys. You really, oh. you were really at a disadvantage. So before we get into end game talk, uh, mm. thank you guys for watching so much. <laughs> yeah. If you've made it to the end of the video, I, I really hope you enjoyed it. We've been hoping to bring a four player root game to the to the table here. Um, this will not be the last. We just really, really love this game. We have solo content coming out soon. The the bot faction is kind of mm -hmm. the Atama faction is is on the way. Along with that. I, I'm sure we will get this to the table with some other yeah, weird sure. combinations. If you made it to the end, here's what I want you to do. First, I want you to leave a comment down below letting us know, this is how we'll tell that you made it to the end of the video, what weird faction combinations would you like to see? Now, we always try to go off of the root price guide. You can find it online based on like what the point buy system is. What board, there's four of them now, mm -hmm. and what groups would you like to see for a three or four player game? That's what we can facilitate. Let us know down below. The second thing, if you're taking the time to comment, if you took the time to watch to this point in the video, share this with a single friend. Get them to subscribe to the channel. It lets Leader Games know that the content we're doing here matters to you, and it allows us to continue doing this. We are a brand new channel, leveraging your support, your eyes, your comments is, is really all the power we have. We go to other companies saying, hey, we've got fans who are interested that like, support, comment, interact, share. We want to talk about and highlight your game. And then we spend 17 hours filming, studying, <laughs> editing, <laughs> uploading. We produce some of the highest quality media in the space, and I'm really proud of that. But it's not possible without your help. So that's my pitch. 
let's get to end game discussions. You were really hurt by the fact that uh, that we were not as violent as an average game of Root is. The fact mm -hmm. that you guys left me alone mm -hmm. and no one messed with you for a long part really made it hard for you to get up and running. I you needed actually, to die a lot more. I thought that too, and that's why I did it like relatively yeah. early in the game. I did that big point swing to make you scared of me. No, I, I saw that. You should have. I, I was thinking I probably should have You should have started fortified. messing with me. I, I think it's way hard quicker. to say what the lizard should do. Because I, I I, I've heard, heard that like, if you leave the lizards alone and don't attack them at all, that's a good way for them to win too. Because then they, they can... They started getting high discard point values. You're right. not wrong. It's just in this, in this setup, mm -hmm. we were a little quicker to the swing than them. Mm -hmm. Give them three more turns... And he could be scoring seven points a turn, but we weren't there. All of us were turned away from end. I think yeah. what happened too is I scared you guys maybe a little, a little too, much. too early. You I should have had because like I actually when you took uh -huh. myself, I only had like one piece in those yeah. things. So I didn't get any acolytes, but I lost like, that, all my That gardens. single turn turn where you attacked I took advantage of the victory points, and then I think Jan was just nervous, yeah. so he went no, in. No, I went for points. Still, really? you yeah. went in swinging as well. Mm -hmm. That was painful. Um, mm -hmm. That shut you down really effectively. Yeah. You guys not messing with me, I think I think swung the game. I Yeah, I could have... Um, it's not really that big fact, of a disparity. I had thought about attacking you way, way early I think on. you should have. And if I had, that could have swung things in an entirely different direction. I scored, I scored a lot of points. Um, by selling you things. Mm hmm So, you know. Mm -hmm. My error was I got cocky and I thought I could take you down over there. Mm. And what I should have done was crafted here mm -hmm. by spending your units to grab that final bunny clearing. Mm -hmm. And I would have scored those four points. And since I already dominated this, I would have been one, two, three, four. Next turn... That's it. Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. So that was that was my mistake. I, I just I focused on the board too much and I didn't look what I had available to me at the beginning yep, of my sure. turn. And that was my mistake. I basically I gave you that final turn. I gave so, you the game at the so end. Interestingly, had I not taken out those buildings of yours, did you were all of yours on the three spot? They were all on the three, but I could have overworked. You could have done the overwork. So I, I did have a path to victory. You just made it a little easier. Okay. Yeah. And and we're sure that you score buildings every time. Yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. I also had a bird somewhere in here or yeah. something like that. So I could have I could have made it. That's without the four? Without mm -hmm. the three? Mm-hmm. I certainly could have made it. Mm -hmm. So that's the game. That's Root. It's a game that we really, uh, we really love and enjoy. Uh, thank you for staying tuned. Uh, whatever you do, though, remember to do the important thing. Get out and play some games. We'll see you next time.